Sup guys, are you guys ready for a scuffed stream? Because the technical difficulties continue on to today. Where's my music at? Sup, Rika? Sup, my dude, Ken? Uh, yeah, scuffed stream. Uh, guess who forgot to set up the, uh... The drawing scene. It was me. Ah, oh, man, guys, this sucks. Did I hit done, actually? When I went to go change the title for the stream? Yes, and. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna take chat time to unscuff the stream. So, uh, why is my model float? <laughs> the stream is scuffed already. And we even we haven't even gotten to the actual stream bit yet. And this, this stream's already scuffed. Oh man, it's great. Okay, let me go ahead and um make a new scene. Yeah, you guys are gonna have an in a live experience of me trying to set this stuff up for OBS. <laughs> <laughs> I've had like no time to set stuff up for streams ever since the computer returned or whatever. So it's great. It's been great. Uh, give me one sec. I have. I have been having the worst luck this month because like um it wasn't s until like monday when i finally got the m.2 drive installed into my computer right oh gosh that music is so actually quiet for some reason and then it's gonna blast our eardrums in a sec but yeah i know i only had monday to s try and re prepare for everything and not even like early monday it was like afternoon Monday, so I'm I'm still trying to play catch up, bro. <laughs> so stuff's gonna be a bit scuffed for a bit. All right. Okay. Totally understandable, thanks, bro. Makes me... <laughs> makes me feel a little less... Stressed. I'll be honest with y'all. I've been really stressed out. I'm... The whole computer thing and having... Okay, you have... You guys actually have no idea how... Set back I am. Because of this whole computer having to die on me. And the universe taking a dump in my Wheaties. Business, like... It's, it's pretty bad. I guess I haven't elaborated how bad it is. I'll like try to explain. Bad and like just stressful bad. Let me try, let me try finishing this thing. I need to, oh no. Okay, the stream's gonna be hyper scuffed today, guys. Let's draw, I'm gonna change the title of the stream too. Hyper scuffed edition. I can't spell. <laughs> I can't spell. <laughs> I'm having I'm having a month right now. I really am. Who wouldn't be stressed out with that? Your whole setup tried to implode. Yeah. Pretty much, everything's messed up, like... 
It's really bad. I'm trying not to be too stressed out about it. Like, I'm slowly starting to get things back to some sort of normalcy. But as you can see, it's, it's not looking good. Okay, I need to take the drawing scene. And edit it real quick. What I'm trying to do right now is trying to fix up the drawing scene just real quick, mate. You know? It completely slipped my mind that I needed to have this, you know, not... <laughs> oh, I don't know anymore. Hopefully by what next week, everything's going to be back to normal. Honestly, that's why I'm playing only like Switch games this week. So that I don't have too much to worry about. And, you know, I can yell at my Switch and stuff while I'm trying to 100% Banjo and Kirby. And play Monster Hunter with all y'all this Saturday, because I missed that. That's done. Yes, save over it. Uh, where am I? Where am I? Hello? <laughs> hey, I'm pretty sure uh, making Control S to take snapshots was kind of a bad idea. I'm gonna go change that now. <laughs> I'm a certifiable dummy dumb. Let's make it Alt S because that can't go wrong, right? Alt S can't go wrong. Oh, hotkeys? <laughs> Sup, Namu? Uh, as you can see, mate, the, the stream's scuffed, dude. The stream's scuffed. Never enough of them. No, there's never enough. I did, um, thanks to you guys, I was actually able to make my life a little easier when it came to streaming. Because, uh, guess who was able to get a little stream deck. Hehe, <laughs> it was me. <laughs> but yeah, no, thanks to you guys, I was able to get me a stream deck as well. It was like on sale, I think, on Amazon. Or maybe because the chair was on sale on Amazon, I was able to spend a little extra on the side. It, it's not one of them like, fancier ones that they have out right now like the stream deck m2 or like that stream deck xl that's a big boy but you know it's just a little basic old stream deck and i've been trying to work on setting that up i heard it all i've been listening while wandering around the house low also <laughs> uh, so you know uh, the uh, stream is scuffed and i'm quickly trying to set up the drawing scene because uh, somebody forgot and that somebody was me. All right. Was it display capture? Wow. Oh, please don't show anything that people don't need to see. I don't trust this. <laughs> I don't trust this. <laughs> please. PLEASE! <laughs> Hide it! There we go. <laughs> okay. Display, I think... Two? Yes. There we go. There's the drawing tablet bit. Guys, it's... It's a learning experience though, guys. You get to see me uh, set everything up and cry about it. Oh, heck, that's too much. Yeah, how is everyone today? As you know, I am... 
<laughs> I'm having a day. Well, I hope all you guys are doing good today. Okay, I need the VTuber now. Right? Yeah, I need the VTuber. There we go. I, I am now here. Oh wait, I'm a dingus. Hold on. Get rid of that. Go over here. And copy... This stuff. I need all this stuff. All of it. Yeah, I've been good. It's just been a good old Wednesday. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear. I really am. Where's the chat? I should fix that now. Oh my gosh, it's past chat time. Yeah, uh, stream scuff today, guys. <laughs> Thank you for understanding. Please! Please! I just need to... Where did the chat just go? Twitch chat. Please. Twitch chat. I, I swear... On this good earth, I'm going to lose my absolute life. I don't care. I'll, I'll fix it on the drawing bit. Oh no, the desk is in the way. Have you ever wanted to see a cat girl cry, guys? This is about to happen. Oh, I don't care. It can be in the way of commissions right now. Yeah, now, my Wednesday has been me just trying to set everything up. As you can see, we're back to the normal model, uh, Rika Beta. And we're gonna try and work on... Oh, guys! Oh, man, about the model, about the upcoming model, guys. I forgot to tell you. I have to do all the work over again. <laughs> Something happened to the file I was working on and thankfully Namu had a spare file. No, did it corrupt? I think so. I think something happened to it. So everything I worked on last stream... It's gone. It's gone. <laughs> So, yeah, we gotta do everything again. Oh, but the good news is I can, co oh, I can copy and paste. But it's still there. This model is the new new model. Like the... Hold on, I'll open it up. To show you. Honey. Honey. What are you doing, honey? You're, you're snoring. <laughs> right there. <laughs> yeah, no. <sighs> Here, let me show you. Hello? Oh, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me! It's stuck now. There we go. Oh my gosh, thank you. Well, not all the work. Yeah, not all the work. Just all the work that we did last stream, which was a lot. So yeah, see, this one is still fine. Right? I did a little work on her last night. I tried to bring back the transparent eyebrows and stuff. But yeah, all the physics and everything, the cool little strawberry shine. I am... I have the worst luck right now. I might have accidentally saved it to a different folder, but it's okay. It's... it's... no. Riku, yo, will turn popcorn. It has to. 
I mean, I did get pretty lucky, guys. You want to know why? <laughs> this is going to sound so dumb. But guess what? Please don't jinx the snow. Please. I'm begging you, don't jinx the snow. Please work. <laughs> Please. Oh, I can copy and paste again. <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> I can copy and paste again, guys! Wow! Because <laughs> if you go, if you don't remember, for some odd reason, last time I could not copy and paste anything. So I, the reason why Namu had a copy of my file and why it's named version Namu messed with by Namu. <laughs> it's because good old Namu came in and was like, okay, tell me what you need copy and pasted and I'll copy and paste it for you. So thank you, Namu. Thank you. <sighs> so yeah, no, for real. Thanks, Namu. But we actually need to go and edit some stuff on the model. Namu, you a hero. I know, Namu's my hero, guys. So we do actually need to edit some stuff on the model. Hopefully we'll get to that today. Such as um, the back teeth. I, you can see them right here. I, I want to edit the back teeth some. So when I turn... Not turn, where is it? When I turn my head, you can see more of it going behind the tongue and stuff. So we gotta edit that bit. Uh, you're here. I'm your manager, Lil. I need to make sure you can get to. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're right. Hold on. I'm gonna move the tablet over just a. Not the tab. Never mind. The tip jar is going to, you know, just chill right there. But yeah, we will get to work on the model hopefully. But I do want to get to work on this charity bit that I've been meaning to work on. We're going to try and finish it tonight because I really want to get the charity thing done. And I'll tell you more about the charity thing too while we're working on it. Namu, am I forgetting anything else today? Hold on, let me switch over to gaming. Tip jar, blah, 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 blah. Okay. One thing I do want to try, though, uh, since it's a scuffed stream already, guys. Bran last night raided me with 28 people, and it did not alert me at all, for whatever reason. So we're gonna do a, uh, a test, because the stream's already scuffed. Why did that sound twice? Did that sound twice? It made me jump. I'm sorry. I don't know if I can turn the volume down. It's supposed to make me jump, so I actually pay attention. Charity was the priority, if I recall correctly. Oh, and the Kirby art. We'll get the sketching done, but I think I want to work on the model. I don't think it sounded twice, but it was indeed loud. Is it super loud or a double play? That's what I'm worried about. Did it double play? Are we on drawing? Hello? Sup, Just? I have returned! Where's my, um, party horn? <laughs> We're still doing party horns today, guys. Yeah, I don't know why it was so freaking loud. And I can't... I can't change the volume? Or can I? I can. Okay, sorry about blasting your eardrums. We gotta send out another test raid. Okay, this is a test raid, guys! Oh, that's loud still, isn't it? I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm actually sorry. It shouldn't be this loud. It shouldn't be loud anymore. I'm sorry. Oh, there we 
we go. It's all better now. Everything is possible as long as you believe in it is. Is that how it works? Oh, please don't tell me I'm blasting your eardrums. I'm sorry. Much better? Okay. I'm actually feeling horrible about this. Okay, sub. We'll turn that one down already. My brain is already half <laughs> I'm so sorry. Me, mine too. My uh, sleep schedule is in shambles, and um, I've <laughs> even though I've had two weeks to fix it, I made it worse. <laughs> Yay! Because of the sound. Oh, well, I'm sure I didn't help. Same settings. Okay, test sub. I'm lying to you all. Why is the... Why is... Wait, why is the tip jar being filled up right now? That's a lie. Okay, that one's not loud. I had to write an analysis about... Who? Wolfgang von... Go... The gay... <laughs> Sorry. How do you pronounce that? Oh no, I can't hear that! No, I didn't mean that. We are looking at how to pronounce... I do not need... No, stop. I just need to know how to pronounce this. You don't need to give me an in-depth analysis. Goethe. 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 Okay, how, with how that's pronounced, there's no freaking way I would have been able to guess, okay? So I'm giving myself a pass on this. Goethe. All right, cool. He's a famous German poet. His, um, his, is it a full last name? Wolfgang von Goethe? Is that his full last name? Or no? I don't know how it works. But, yeah, he sounds familiar. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and close this. And bring up the art. Because we have a charity bit to do. I do. And you guys are here to watch. I work on charity thing. I don't know if it's his last name, but I I don't know either. Alright. So, let me explain what this charity bit is. So, on DeviantArt, there's a group that I've been a part of for a while. Uh, let me see if I can find them real quick. Charity thing. When's the last time I did a charity thing for them? For them. Right here. <laughs> so, the charity thing, there's a guy on DeviantArt who runs uh, a group called the Charity Guild. Tommy GK. Right? And Tommy has has been, how, how should I say this? He's been very helpful, charitable. That's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> I said it, guys. I finally got it out. But yes, Tommy has been very charitable and runs a lot of uh, these charity collabs. And uh, last time, I think was the gingerbread. He did a gingerbread one. <laughs> And this is the thing I did, just a real quick. <laughs> and so what we do is that we draw stuff on this, like, big old, like, uh, canvas. Or we send 
uh, Tommy the picture. Pictures. And it gets added to this big, um, bigger picture. I'm so good at explaining stuff today, guys. Oh my goodness. Here, let me see if I can show off the picture. Uh. Well, I'd want to ask Tommy for his permission first before I showed it off. The bigger picture gets sold or what? That's a good question. The gingerbread one, uh, every 10 submissions will pack one shoe box for Operation Christmas Child. It was the last one. I don't know if, um, this stuff comes straight out of Tommy's pocket or what. But I'll have to get back to you on that. It's been a bit. I kind of just draw the thing. I should probably ask Tommy how it works. <laughs> but anyway. So what we get to do, the artists, all we have to do is just draw a Pokemon, a Digimon, or both. And that's how we're able to contribute to uh, whatever charity thing uh, Tommy is currently hosting. I'm very knowledgeable about charity groups. The only group I know is Raphius. Never. <laughs> I don't know if that says anything about me. But yeah, last time, or the last charity, apparently we got 18 shoe boxes. Which is really nice. This one... The new project is another Pokemon and Digimon one. And this one is... Oh, excuse me, sorry. Excuse me. I'll link it in the Discord. So you guys can check it out. The stream is so scuffed. I guess I'll put it in art sharing since it's art related. Okay, here's the link. What do you mean low power mode? You're plugged in. Or not. I'll figure that out in a second. This is the charity collab that I am participating in. I'll be working on my art collab tonight on stream. Smiley face. <laughs> but yeah, I'll, I put it in the art sharing bit if you guys want to check it out. So yeah, uh, tonight for the charity bit, I always have been drawing. Well, one time I did some a different pair, <laughs> but I'm gonna be working on these two <laughs> because I can't help myself. 
But yeah, I'm gonna be drawing Cramorant and Dracomon for the charity bit. It's been a while since I've drawn anything Digimon related, actually. Digimon? Yeah! I love Digimon, man. There hasn't been like a really good Digimon game as of late, though. Like, there was one on the PC, Digimon Cyber Sleuth, right? Never watched an episode? Oh, my heart. I watched a lot of the one with... Okay, you've never watched it, so you have no idea what I'm talking about. I think Namu might. Wh which one was it? Digimon Tamers? The one with Gyumon, Terriermon, and uh, Renamon? That was my jam. Let's go ahead. But yeah, I was a big Pokemon fan too, but I also love the idea of Digimon. Like, digital creatures living in your phone or something, being like your best friend. I think it was Tamers, yeah, but I stopped watching by then. Oh, dude, Tamers was my jam, bro. And Dracomon is one of my favorite Digimon, actually, as well. It's more on the back of his head. See, something about the second series had put me off. Maybe I'll revisit Tamers. As far as the digi design goes, the Renamon and Impmont lines are sick as heck. Oh, dude, yeah, they are. And I was a big fan of uh, Terriermon. Let me go ahead and pull those up so then you guys know what we're talking about. Renamon. Renamon. Pull them up. And then... Then my favorite from that series was Terriermon. Terriermon. Which you think is a dog, <laughs> but it's not. Oh man, I love Digimon. But yeah, here. So this one here is Renamon. This one was Impmon. And then this little cutie patootie was Terriermon. I really should draw more of Terriermon because he is so cute. And he also has a counterpart, actually. Lop. Them. They're so cute. And then this brown one is Lopmon, and she's also one of my favorites. Digimon scared me as a little lad. Oh, yeah? Their designs can be pretty edgy, and it is a little darker than uh, Pokemon. I will say. I loved it. 
his bottom mouth is looking a bit long. That should fix it. It's been a bit since I've drawn Dracomon. His bottom jaw is still looking a bit long. Probably because. There we go! lessons and needs a kind of academy. Both cost money and that money probably funds the charity. Oh, so that's how he funds the charity. <laughs> I'm bad. <laughs> I never actually questioned it because I was like, oh, that's nice, and I probably should have looked it up myself. But that's good to know now. Yeah, but I mean, Tommy's been doing this for like years now, so if there was a problem, then I'm pretty sure it would have been dealt with by now, but nah, Tommy's good, guys. No worries there. Yeah, from my interactions with Tommy as well, he seems like a really nice guy. So... Let's see. It is sad, though, that there are so many, like, charity scams. It's honestly quite messed up, in my opinion. No question that. Just doing research first is always good. Oh yeah, no. Um, I think I've been doing s stuff with Tommy, uh, collab-wise for a good couple years now. When I, <laughs> back in the day when I was more of a dummy. So I guess I just never realized I should, you know, maybe ask how the charity actually works. Oh my gosh, yeah, I've been doing collab stuff for that group for years. And big emphasis on years. Oh my gosh. Like 2000. I want to say like 2014. Bro. For real? I think the first charity thing I did with Tommy was when they were doing more like curvy stuff, and that was my jam. Uh, if you guys don't know my VTuber lore, I'm kind of obs I was, back in the day, obsessed with Kirby, and then fell out of it for a bit, and now it's resurfaced. Kirby? 
in my gallery. 2015, my bad. So I've been doing collaboration thingies with Tommy since 2015. I was kind of a I was kind of an idiot in 2015. So that was my bad. 2015? Bro. That's crazy. the eyeball. So we're gonna do another sketch layer, guys. I don't have him looking anymore. Okay. That's crazy. I'm doing that. I was around 10. Bro. It's crazy, isn't it? I was just, I think I was just starting college in 2015, or in the middle of <laughs> that god awful, I mean, good old college experience. Oh, dang. <laughs> head too big. Oh, that's okay. Draw big or go home. There we go. I made his head too massive. I always draw too big now, guys. I actually used to draw super small. Like, on very small canvases and stuff. And then college was like, hey, if you continue to draw that small, um, I'm gonna bust your knees. He's like, oh no, not my knees. And ever since college, I've been drawing on massive canvases. So now, I just have a tendency to draw stuff too big. Which is kind of funny, actually. Like I say, guys, draw big or go home. Seven years is just crazy. I have done a little bit of minor charity work and I couldn't imagine doing that for seven years. Bro, yeah, I think Tommy has been doing the charity thing for even longer. But I mean, I'm not doing, I'm not doing a lot, a lot, you know, I'm just, I'm just drawing Pokemon, Digimon and Kirby and stuff, you know? I'm, I'm just doing what, little I can and if I can help by drawing something you know that that's great like that's my personal belief anyway I know I'm not doing a lot but at least I'm I'm still able to do something even if it's a only a little minor thing
Just for me? It's mind blowing? Yeah? Oh man, I was gonna put him in a hat. We'll figure out the hat in a sec. We also gotta make sure he's got his Digimon eyes. Which is like, you know. I'm kinda like that. I swear to goodness, every time I draw this Digimon, it looks different. Okay, there we go. That looks a little better. We'll come back to the Tifers here in a sec. Oh, my favorite part. Always trying to figure out how the legs work. I need to actually look up for a reference of Dracomon. Dra Oh, come on. I need to find one where he's walking. I'm really not. Or maybe I won't. Focus on trying to envision how you be walking. Something you know, like that. Once again, we're gonna probably also do another. him holding. They're gonna be in a wheat field, which is you know, that's fine. And I know they're gonna be in a wheat field, but I do want I do want him to be like holding some sort of produce other than wheat, I guess. So I don't know, like a potato. A potato turn up. Maybe a carrot? And another potato. More potatoes. Some more potatoes! You can never have too many potatoes, guys. Alright, and now we also gotta do cramorant as well. Aw, oh, man, cramorant's gonna be fun. Okay, Cramorant, right? I love Cramorant, and I... <laughs> I play a lot of Pokemon Unite, which is basically Pokemon League of Legends. And I think I'm cursed. Okay, because of Cramorant. For some... For some reason, I cannot win any match unless I'm playing Cramorant. And then, and in which case, I am a freaking god with Cramorant. I am the destroyer of worlds with Cramorant. I don't know why I was given this power. He's gonna, okay, he's gonna have a carrot in his mouth. Because Cramorant spits out, you know, fish. But, oh, uh, you know, well now, it's a carrot this time. Can't... Can you even stay up until five without question? Even though it's the middle of the week, extended weeks. <laughs> extended weekends for the win! Yay! Dude, yeah, I've been having a bad time of just staying up too late. I really 
it and you really need to fix it. What game? Pokemon Unite. It's on the Switch, and it's basically like the same thing as League of Legends. What is that called? Like a MOBA? Right? It's a MOBA? And I can't... I don't know why! I can only win games as Cramorant. It's a MOBA, yeah, and I think it's on the phones as well. Oh yeah, that thing is on the phone. Massive online battle arena. Oh, that's what Mo I mean... I knew what MOBA stood for! I totally knew what MOBA stood for. Totally. The phone version sucks more than the PC version. There's a PC. I wish I could play on the PC. That'd be the bee's knees. <laughs> oh no, my party horn. There we go. Okay. I hope that woke you all up. There's a PC version of Pokemon Unite. Yesent. I think there's like an unofficial version on the PC. No lol. I know there is a way to play on the PC, but it's not like an official way. In which case, they really should just put the darn thing on PC. What am I doing? It doesn't have a duck body. It's got like more of an oval body. I don't like how this body shape is looking anyway. I wanted Cramorant to be smaller than Dracomon. Carrot looks like. Last time we played for a bit and then stopped. Fortunately, I didn't start again because of Arcane. Glad I played it. Both versions are bad. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know why I keep playing Pokemon Unite. I think I have a problem. I'm not gonna lie. I do genuinely believe I have a problem. Is that a Digimon? I love Digimon. <gasps> Me too! Digimon makes me cry so much. Oh man, guys, the uh, Digimon Try movies are free on YouTube with ads. If you want to watch all the Digimon Try movies, and I want to watch all the Digimon Try movies. We'll never stop being salty. Did Swain dirty. <laughs> But yeah, I'm drawing a bit for charity, and I'm drawing Cramorant and Dracomon. As you can see, did anyone try made me cry like a baby? Oh man, I can't wait then. That means it's really good. Right? Okay, Cramorant's neck I think needs to be a little bigger. 
Then we can move on to like the wings and stuff. <laughs> Gosh, I love this dopey bird. I'm not shrimping. So then why is my model... Ah! Hey guys, you ready for more scuff stream? Oh yes, you guys ready for more scuff stream? Cause I gotta go mess with my settings. Oh no! That's not what I meant to do. Yeah, <laughs> everything's still scuffed, guys. Oh man, I love it. Where is mouth open? Mouth open. Zero, one. And that's good enough. Okay, no more scuff stream. Uh, so, when you are doing stuff in live 2D, you sometimes have to mess with the uh, settings. Because sometimes uh, it thinks your mouth is slightly open when it's really not. Scuff stream? Heck yeah, that's what I'm here for, forgive me. No more shrimping. I watch time. What's watch time? Is that a thing that you can have for um <laughs> the stream? Apparently, uh, there's a lot more commands I need to include for the stream, but uh, I don't know how to actually get them to work. Oh, I'm a scuffed streamer, guys. Uh, and the stream is looking pretty scuffed too. The bitrate keeps dropping, but. Unless you guys tell me anything looks wrong, I will have no idea if anything looks wrong. Here, let me... Mm, that's okay. There are bots for that, yes. Hide. Yeah, the only commands we have available for yours are ones related to the queues for open hub hunting. Yeah. And the shillings for shilling the Discord. <laughs> I'm gonna abuse this power. This newfound power I have. I have no idea what a co coffee is. Coffee is basically Patreon, but personally, I like it a little bit more because it's got options like a shop so i can like give you guys access to it's where people can commission rika for art thank you namu simplest solution simple blah, 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 blah. simplest explanation brought to you by namu okay that's scuff hold on i gotta stand up and grab a thing Uh, because for some reason my phone doesn't want to charge right now. Oh no. That's not good. Guys! 
You, this can't be happening. I cannot have this bad of luck, right? Hold on. Because my phone is not charging, like, at all. Am I that unlucky? Are you telling me my, my charging cord died on me? Like, just today? <gasps> I heard the noise. Oh my gosh! Yes! Okay. 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 We're good. We're back in business. I think. Yeah, we're back in business. Okay, now I'm gonna remind me that we need to look into including more commands in Twitch, if you'd be so kind. Also remind me that I need to play around with my stream settings, because I think my settings are a little scuffed right now, and I cannot change them unless I quit the stream. And we're not doing that. We're, we're not doing that tonight. I opened Twitter for the first time in a while, and the first thing I see is an ad for an indie game that tries to get players by showing waifus. Oh man. But my waifu though. Oh my gosh, you're right. I have been safe this whole time. <laughs> Let's see, art 2020. Oh, I'll press all F. <laughs> no, 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 I'm saving right now. I promise. But you want to know what else is scuffed, guys? How, do you notice something right here? Well, for one, uh, you can see my files, and I usually don't like people looking at this. But today is a different day. No. Do you do you see do you see what's wrong here, guys? Do you notice how barren this folder is? My like games are just complicated paying money for a chance at this high quality waifu PNG. Yeah. Or if they're fancy, the waifu is an animated uh PNG. <laughs> but notice how bare this folder is, I say, as I slowly caress my Wacom, for whatever reason. All of my art is unorganized and not in proper folders. Another scuffed bit that I have to deal with. Thankfully, it, I don't think it's too bad. Maybe, but uh, nothing is in folders pretty much right now. Everything is kind of free floating in a singular folder that my husband put together for me so that he could attempt to save all of my art. Uh, but it's, it's just free. I'd rather play gotchas than those games. Same. But yeah, I gotta make a new folder. And name it Doodles. What's the month? 5 2022 underscore charity. And that's how I name my folders, guys. But yeah, I, I have so much organizing. I still need to re-download stuff. It's really bad. To be fair, I have investors over 70 hours in the Genshin Impact in like 20 days. I have- I stopped playing Genshin. I, I felt like after I took a little break for a bit, I, I was just so behind. I feel like I'm constantly having to play catch up in that game, and I'm not really a fan of that. Of, like, having to play catch-up like that. Uh, 
That, and it really feels like you need to really invest a lot of money in order to have good characters in that game, too. I, was, I stopped when I was able to play PC games again. Yeah, no, I, I stopped playing Genshin. That and the uh, Genshin community is pretty wild, I'll say. And I was like, mm, no thanks. You guys are chill, but like, especially on Twitter, the Genshin community is... <laughs> no! You have caught me off guard! The saxophone is currently in the case, and now I gotta go bust it out. Okay, give me one sec. I gotta, I gotta go, gotta go bust out the saxophone. Just give me one sec. Because I was cleaning it. I was cleaning the saxophone last night. I was doing some good old maintenance. saxophone stand, right? Look, I got the saxophone stand, right? But you're not really supposed to leave a saxophone out like that and, like, still put together. Wait, no, I don't put oil in there. So I was doing, uh, some maintenance on my saxophone last night and I forgot to get it together for today's stream. The stream is scuffed, guys! The stream is scuffed! Still, I hope you're enjoying the scuffed stream! Oh wait, where's my lead? There. Wait, where'd I put my mouthpiece? I just had it. I just had it. Hold up, full stop. Where did I put that? I just had it! I just had it! How do I- oh, there you go. I found it! Okay, I'm back. And I have the saxophone now. Man, today is Hyper Scuffed Stream. Did I put that in the title? Yeah, it's Hyper Scuffed Stream. That's what I call scuffed. Heck yeah. Okay. Cause I don't know if you guys could actually hear me cause I was trying to kind of do a bit. Oh my gosh. The next track, scuffed. But uh, like, I was saying, I was doing some maintenance on my saxophone last night. Because you're not really supposed to leave the mouthpiece and stuff on the saxophone. Like, uh, for too long. Without, you know, maintenance or what? Um, how should I say this? You don't want to leave them- Ah, I just pinched myself. 
don't want to leave the mouthpiece on. Or, uh, there's a chance that your mouthpiece could get stuck on the cork. Because you're supposed to put, uh, cork grease and stuff. Okay. Where's my sheet music? I- Guys, I, I need to find more sheet music. <gasps> Should we do a music stream where Rika tries to play music badly? <laughs> or transpose music, which means, uh... Translating music? I think that's the best way to explain that, right? Translating music? Foxy boy, sup? Welcome to scuffed art stream that is now being derailed into a music stream. I now have the saxophone ready. And I gotta back up. Oh, we gotta tune the bad boy too. Online instrument tuner. Oh my goodness gracious. That wasn't good. It did it again! Guys! NC19 raiding with a party of three. Thank you for the raid and thanks, uh, Alert Box for not. This is gaming moment. Hey yo, sup, NC? Thanks for the raid. I'm sorry that the notification didn't go off again. Hello? That's not good. Uh oh. Is there something wrong with my s <laughs> No. No, please don't tell me there's something wrong with the saxophone. It was working fine yesterday. It's all good. I break everything eventually. Well, I've been having a day, my dude. My, my stream is pretty scuffed right now. And now the saxophone seems to be kind of scuffed. And it's starting to actually wig me out a little bit. Um, oh, thank gosh. Oh, my gosh. It's okay. The saxophone's okay. Oh my gosh. Woo! We're good. We're back in business, boys. We're nearing the level of really scuffed. We really are, dude. It's hyper scuffed. Saxophone is alive. Her baby is alive. Oh, you have no idea. I give my saxophone a little kiss. <laughs> This is my baby. Okay. Whew. No! No! Please! Stop it! Stop it! What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong this time? Is a note stick? Is a key sticking? Please! Please tell me what's wrong. It was working for a hot second and then decided uh, to scare me again. I'm not pressing a key while I'm sitting here. Yeah, uh, I want to get better. Alright. I feel you. Here's what we're working on while I try to figure out what's wrong. No. No, what's wrong, baby? What's wrong? You were working for a second. What's... What's wrong? No, no, I blame the person that wanted sex. But wait, <laughs> wait, yeah, just it was working fine yesterday, last night. When I did the saxophone bit. Alright guys, the stream is completely derailed until I figure out what's wrong with my saxophone. It sounds like a key is being pressed down somewhere. Hold on. Wait. I figured it out. 
I figured out what's wrong. I think. Hold on, I gotta test it. Okay, okay, that's the sound of a saxophone that's working, and I still don't know what the problem is. I gotta hydrate. Thanks, Pisces. I, I need a- I'm, I need a sec. <laughs> Oh, no. You guys were right. I really can't catch a break. I really cannot. Alright. Let me... No! No! No, please! I'm standing up now. Please. Please, baby. What's wrong? What's... <laughs> I have to stretch. I'll stretch in a second, but I can't put the saxophone down until I figure out what's wrong. I'll hold that stretch off. No, what is wrong? Something's wrong. No. Not my baby, please. No, 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 no. <laughs> Is wrong like actually <laughs> Hudson we have a problem maybe hit it violence is always the answer no I'll never hit my baby wait maybe this is the problem something isn't closing all the way for some reason what's causing it wait Am I using- yeah, no, I'm using the right- I'm like, for this? What's wrong? It lost its love for you because you haven't kept up with it. No! That's not true! So what's wrong? Oh, oh. I think I found what's wrong, but I don't know why it's being like this. It was working fine last night. For some reason, it doesn't want to close all the way at the top. Do I have to like, I might need to unscrew it and try repairing it that way. And stream without a problem! You're dang right! <laughs> one day without having a problem on my stream is that possible another drink all right I'll, t I'll take another drink i'll sit down and take another drink okay. but i think i found this the problem to the saxophone something is keeping it from closing at the top i don't know how to explain it still have to stretch that's right I'll, i'm holding off the stretch once i figure out what's wrong with my baby okay we can get through a single song and then i will try to take apart my saxophone which sounds like a terrible idea but you know <laughs> It sounds fine now. Your baby lost its will to live, maybe. No! Don't say that. 
Don't say that, please. Please. Yeah, okay, I see what the problem is. But I do not know how to fix the problem. Maybe I think I just fixed the problem. I fixed the problem. We're all good. What were you working on art-wise? Pokemon and Digimon. Give me one sec. We gotta do the bit. And then I'll explain everything. I promise. Pinky promise, even. and we did the bit <gasps> okay oh wait i gotta stretch first too thanks nc sorry about that mate i just i had to know what was wrong with my saxophone <laughs> i gotta drink some more okay thank you thank you for taking care of me guys I don't know how I survived these past two weeks without you guys. Oh, God. It's so good to be back. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good now. Okay. Now, let's put the music back on. All right. So, I left my thing. I don't know either. Apparently, your sax didn't even. I, I know, right? Even my saxophone was depressed. <laughs> even my saxophone was depressed. Give me one sec. Okay, I left the drawing glove by the saxophone. Okay, so. We're all good now. So, what we're working on is that we're working on a there we go we're working on uh do you blame the minecraft villagers i think i'm gonna dude i think they were in on it <laughs> know how i survived without these streams learning non-stop due to exams oh dude i feel it for you but um we're doing a charity bit I am a part of a charity collab on DeviantArt through the guild known as Charity Guild, run by a username Tommy GK. And Tommy has been doing this for a good bit now, and I've been uh, doing these collabs for a good bit now. Okay, the saxophone neck strap is actually making my neck sweaty. <laughs> so I gotta take it off. Okay, it's right there. So. What we do, the artists, all we have to do is draw either Pokemon, Digimon, or both to help with the charity. Oh gosh, I linked it in the Discord. <laughs> Join the Discord if you haven't. And um, the theme is farming. So I'm drawing Dracomon and Cramorant with some vegetables. Even though they're in a wheat field, but you know what? No one's stopping me. Yeah, charity. Go charity. Yeah. Um, I mentioned earlier, but I've been doing this for a good couple. Join house will be join Discord and Strahlas will be happy. Yes. We all want to make Strahlas happy, so you should totally join the Discord. <laughs> Someone needs to take these away from me. Really do. Okay. Now let's get back to art stream. Now that 
we're, we're no longer derailing the stream. I'm gonna hopefully, by the way, Monster Hunter Rise dropped the final weapon showcase, so all 14 video weapons are out. I actually forgot about those. <laughs> Whoops. I should probably watch this here, huh? Maybe I'll do like a scuffed live react tomorrow, yeah? Uh, because I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. We have a couple options. Either I can get angry at Kirby Crystal Shards some more. Or you can guys can hear me make dumb noises non-stop while I play Banjo-Kazooie. <coughs> oh, and uh, I think I also said that all 14 weapons, some good... Got some good bots, so I've got some mediocre stuff. I hope they didn't do my hunting horn dirty. We'll have to see. They definitely did Lance dirty. I heard something about that on Twitter. Oh yeah, here are the two Pokemon- the Digimon and the Pokemon we're working on, by the way. If you don't know Pokemon, this is Cramorant. And then, for those of you who don't know Digimon, this one right here is Dracomon. And they're both, like, really my favorites. <laughs> and I've been drawing these two for the collab for a while now, so I'm, I'm keeping up the trend. Never touched Rise because lack of... Munners? Monies, I'm assuming. And the price in Brazil currency is stupidly high, but I heard uh, Longsword is getting lots of hate. I also heard that Longsword is getting a lot of hate for some reason. I didn't investigate. Because I was like, oh yeah, I'll watch the video. And then promptly forgot and probably <laughs> took a nap. what a carrot looks like. I think that's what I said before the stream got completely derailed. Okay, we're gonna draw the carrot just without the little wiggly loops, yeah. There we go, there's a carrot. And probably forgot and took a nap. So relatable. <laughs> Heck yeah. Nap time is important, guys. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Longsword is good, can counter almost everything, high damage output, got a buff to its counter, got what some people are calling great sword looking attack. I'm excited for my heavy bowgun though, since I main heavy bowgun, and it got some good buffs. I can't wait for Sunbreak. Oh dude, that's next month, guys. Are you guys excited? It's the end of next month, but I'm still pretty excited for it. Heartbreaking. I've been playing World again because I'm broke, lol. I'm not gonna lie. 
I've been thinking about playing World again. Because I miss World. World was one of my all-time favorite Monster Hunter games. I have so many fond memories of World. I died so much in World. <laughs> Oh my gosh. World is such a good game. And I think they're working on a... Another one like World? Right? I think the Capcom is working on... Another Monster Hunter World-like game. Yeah, World was so much fun. Maybe I'll come back to Freedom Unite someday, too. I am i don't think I've ever played Freedom Unite. I cannot confirm. Cannot remember. is so fun to draw, I think. Well, in my opinion, older generations are worth a try, but they also have some really good fans, too. Oh, man. That's always <laughs> no fun. Just let people play what they want, how they want, you know? That's- that's my opinion. Just play how you want, what you want. If you're not hurting anybody, then there's no problem. Parents got that look where we can get a goofball. <laughs> and it's great. I know, right? I love Cramorant! I remember when I first ran in Cramorant in Pokemon, um, Sword and Shield. Dude. I think this was before I learned that Cramorant had its ability. Maybe? I can't remember now. But I remember I ran into one, I was really excited because I'm like, oh my gosh, I kind of want this on my team. And then it used Dive, and then came back out with a Pikachu. And I was like... Bro, put that Pikachu down! <laughs> I was like, I'll save you, Pikachu! And then I hucked a Pokeball at it. And I caught it. And I named her Carol. And she was perfect. And she stayed in my team. And helped me beat... Leon. It was love at first sight, guys. Well, love at first, uh, gulp missile. More like it. There's the carrot instead of a fish because we're doing um, a golden teddy bear. I loved her so much. You had a shiny beware? Is that how you pronounce that? <laughs> beware? The last one before I headed out. One last what? Oh. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Pisces. You have yourself a woman in. She was amazing. Aw, oh, dude, what was my team? It's been a hot second. I'm having a hard time remembering. 
Because when, uh, oh my gosh, when the expansion came out, I switched my team out. Because I wanted, I thought we were going to start from level 1 again. Which was my mistake. That was, I guess, too much optimism for Game Freak. Or whatever. And too much hope. Because we did not, in fact, start from level 1. But I still wanted a new team anyway. I named... I'd name it Golden Graham. Yes. But my new team consisted of Galarian Meowth, Galarian Slowpoke, um, Lopunny. After reading the Pokedex entry, I would 1000% name it Stinky Butt. <laughs> Uh, what else? I think I had a shiny Sylveon? I can't remember. I'll, I will have to double check. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Also, Rika, where is the obligatory? Nevi, get in the bag! Get in the bag, Nevi! We're not. <laughs> Nevi! We're not playing games! Get in the bag! There we go. I think you're thirsty in Nation Desert that is Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Yeah, I was about to say, are you guys excited for those two? I am. I wonder if we're gonna see any, um, regional variants. I'm, s I'm sorry, but nothing can really top a uh, Galarian Meowth for me. Always remember to be careful for some stupid reason Pokemon games tend to leak whole months before launch. I want to be excited, but it won't give us things to be excited about. Yeah, though, it's coming out November, right? So I'm sure we'll hear more about it closer to then, you know? I'm pretty sure they want to focus on Splatoon 3, I guess, with announcing whatever the heck... Uh, like, even then, I barely heard anything about Splatoon 3. Oh, wait, that got delayed. Never mind. Man, June, July. I have to wait until August. I am here, but I'm kind of lurking while I eat supper and do all my evening stuff. You're all good, mate. No worries here. We're just talking about... The new Pokemon game? I'm getting Violet. What are you guys getting? I mean, I mean, I guess I shouldn't just pick because I like purple. I'm hoping that Violet has some good ex That's so dumb for me to say, hold up. I hope Violet has some good exclusive Pokemon. I hate the exclusive Pokemon crap. Honestly. I don't know why that almost came out of my mouth. Yeah, I hope I get good exclusive Pokemon. Bleh. I don't know squat really about Pokemon. I've never really played any of them. Oh man, they're so good. Personally, my favorites, my favorite Pokemon game would have to be Pokemon Black and White. So that's when stuff was starting to get a bit bonkers and I freaking loved it. Black and White 2 
had an airship. <laughs> and an airship with a weapon that was being powered by a legendary Pokemon. And I thought that was so sick, dude. I'm like, oh man, this is actually serious. Yes, yeah, black and white were so good. They were so good, dude. Didn't they also have like a hard mode or something? Where if you beat the game the first time, you could go back and replay it, but on a harder difficulty, and for some freaking reason, they have never done that since. They've actually made Pokemon games easier, and I hate it. It's my only gripe right now. No, which, that's a lie. That's one of my gripes when it comes to Pokemon games currently. Is that they're, they've made them so, like, baby mode. I'm like, bro, please. It was hard and difficult, yeah, but only barely. And, like, they should let you pick hard mode the first playthrough. Yeah, that's a fair. That's a fair statement. Like, I do think it's weird that they keep trying to... Well, I guess this last Pokemon game, I think it was pretty valid to make you go through a bunch of tutorial stuff because it was, in fact, a new formula for the game. Oh my gosh, how do you draw duck feet? I guess like that. Hey, Freak, I am not a child. I crave violence. Legends Arceus was so good. Bro, I have some beef with Arceus, okay? If you were there, you know. But the last the last fight with Arceus freaking almost destroyed me. Mentally. It was awful. <laughs> Did you get tilted at the towers? What towers? Hold up, what towers? Uh I got the memory of a P. So uh what are you talking about? Which towers? I'm assuming at this point it's okay for me to talk about spoilers for this game that's been out for a good couple months, right? <laughs> there shouldn't be no problem with me talking about spoilers at this point. Oh, this is a bad Fortnite joke? Oh! oh lol, I DK about the towers, but there are certain those that are getting tilted at various parts of the game. Oh my gosh, yeah. Only play a bit of the first one, Red, I think that my friend had. The original games were really good. I played Pokemon Yellow, and that will always have a very special place in my heart. No, uh, Arceus is a bully, for one, okay? If you want me to be real with you, Arceus gave me <laughs> a hard time. And he's a big bully, and I don't appreciate him doing that to me. Being an absolute bully like that. Oh my gosh, how do you draw? Duck feet, dude. Arceus casually kidnapping some random kid to save the world, and then proceeding to beat up said kid, okay? He then just takes you and just starts going <laughs> And not even bringing him back. Oh, is it canon that Arceus is like, Lamal? Peace out, kid. Good luck. After beating you up. I did not own a switch. I, when, if you ever get the chance, I do highly recommend getting your hands on a Switch because there are a lot of fun games on the Switch. Yeah, no, Arceus summons you, asks you to do this bit for him, proceeds to beat you up, and then just kind of leaves you. Hey, Arceus kidnapped more than one kid. 
Oh yeah, that's true. He also um, kidnapped Ingo, I guess? We still don't know how he got there, right? Oh, this looks ugly. This looks ugly! Hold on, I'm deleting these feet. There we go, that looks a little better now. Oh man, I really hope we can get to working on the model tonight. But I really do need to catch up on all that work I've lost. Oh man. If not, if we don't get to the model tonight, I will work on the model after stream. Because there are a couple of tutorials I need to watch. Oh, oh, that's right. Both Ingo and lots of Pokemon from the future. Porygon, Magmite, got Isekai because of space-time rips. That's right, that's right. I'm holding you to that? Uh-oh. Well, Nama will ensure that I get work done on the model now, guys. I do want to get this charity thing done, though, first and foremost, because the due date is coming up, and I'd like to be able to finish it on time without feeling like I'm rushing to get it done. What is up with this duck foot, okay? Why can't I draw this not like butts? Does this look like butts? Okay. Arceus was the name of the latest game, correct? Yes! Pokemon Legends Arceus was the latest installment of the Pokemon franchise. I don't know why I said it like that, but yes. <laughs> it was really good. And the fact that you can run around and just huck Pokeballs at Pokemon now. I'm gonna just hope this looks okay. How many times am I gonna suck at drawing this duck foot? Alright, that works. Alright, and we're gonna do the good old patent, uh, stylized stuff now. Because I cannot make this duck foot look any better. I know it's a cramorant. enjoyed Arceus a lot. I was kind of sad that they got rid of abilities, which are coming back. Do the same thing with duck feet that I do with hands. We do it 50 times because it never looks right, lol. Yeah, no. I also do that with hands. What the heck? Oh, okay. With just plain old hands as well. I feel like the I feel like his feet need to be bigger because he uses these to swim. So 
so we need to go like all right let's move on to dracomon real quick up how do I Dude, did you want to be weird? What did you say the names of these Pokemon were? Uh, it's a Pokemon and a Digimon. So, uh, this one's name right here. The bird is Cramorant. And then this little dragon boy right here, his name is Dracomon. Because I am uh, a fan of both Pokemon and Digimon. And these two are like one of my favorites. And I've been drawing them for the charity bit for a while now. So it's kind of like my thing to draw both Cramorant. They're like my usual go-to, if that makes sense. They're like my usual. What's a Digimon? <gasps> What's a Digimon? No, I'm joking. Digimon uh, is like digital monsters. Instead of Pokemon where they're like pocket monsters, Digimon are virtual creatures that live in a place called the digital world. It's essentially like Pokemon with a couple of differences such as Digimon, when they evolve, they do they instead do a digivolution. And they can actually turn back into their little smaller forms. So yeah, but Digimon is basically digital monsters and Pokemon are pocket monsters. Both have a card game too, by the way. But yeah, Pokemon is a lot more popular than Digimon, which is why I don't think you hear a lot about Digimon. The original Digimon series was an isekai before isekai was cool. Yeah, it was about a bunch of kids who went to camp, and then they end up getting transported to the digital world where they meet up with their Digimon partners and stuff. And they're trying to find a way back home. They can talk too. That's another important part about Digi I, which I forgot to mention. So that they can also talk. I was aware of Pokemon, but never heard of Digimon before. Yeah, like I said, uh, it's less pop. It's still really popular, but not as popular, I think, as Pokemon. Then we're just going to copy and paste this bad boy over. That looks awful. I think 
they're supposed to actually be farther apart. Yeah, they're supposed to be farther apart. And Digimon is more edgier than Pokemon as well, I guess you could say. I think, like, people die in Digimon. Not like people, but the Digimon do. Edgier? How so? Yeah, a lot of Digimon have guns on them. Guns! <laughs> some of them look like tanks. Some of them have, like... I mean, what, Devi Beamon or something? What does Impmon did you evolve into? <laughs> oh, no, it's Basilmon. How many did you evolve into? So like, for example, there's this little guy. And this is like, I guess, one of his digivolutions or evolutions now. They're starting to refer them more to like, just evolutions than just digivolution. Isn't there a turtle with cannons on his back in Pokemon? That's true, but... Blastoise... <laughs> is not as edgy as this guy. I think Digimon can be explained as a lot of belts. A lot of belts, a lot of welded together parts, I guess. I don't know. To me, it just looks a lot edgier than Pokemon. Water cannons. Yeah. Not cannons, but water cannons. <coughs> yeah, you got this guy. There's a couple other really edgy Digimon as well. And they have, like, actual guns, too. Which is freaking hilarious. I know little to nothing about either. Yeah, trust us. Digimon is way edgier. I think I did the arm okay? I don't know, it's hard to tell. Skull... Sa... Hanuman? Is that real name, or did you make that up? Skull Satanmon? Whereas Digimon characters called things like Skull Satanmon. No, I swear, there's like Devilmon or Devimon. Uh, there's like a lot of crazy ones. 
Oh yeah, this Digimon, the one Digimon I showed you also apparently has a motorcycle. It's wild. I'm so bad at drawing, like, the legs of these Digimon. Didn't make it up. He evolves from Devimon. Oh my gosh, does he really? I for real thought you made that up, Namu. But then I was like, wait a minute, that does sound like a Digimon that they have. But I'm like, there's no way that actually exists. Okay. No, it actually exists. Good to know. Oh my gosh, we're gonna need another sketch layer just for Dracomon's little leggies. Okay, he's gonna be holding a potato. his fingers to be interlocked while he's holding this stuff just to make this look a little bit more believable which is funny because it's Digimon but anyway yeah we're gonna need another layer already Blame Digimon World 1 and getting that bunch of poop thrown at me to death. <laughs> what is N Nanimon? Nanimon makes me legitimately upset for reasons I cannot explain. <laughs> the best Digimon is Nanimon. Is that Geomon? Oh, I missed that for a sec. Sorry. No, this is Dracomon. It is this guy, my dude. Sorry, I got like really absorbed into drawing. <clears throat> <coughs> Yeah, we're drawing Dracomon and Cramorant for a charity thing. Who was obsessed? He's a little weird little orb man who got kind of gritty biker vibes, but also what if warrior and Pac-Man had a child? <laughs> who was obsessed with throwing poop. Oh my gosh. That's funny. I'm so sorry, Nami. Sounds like he made you suffer a lot. Pac-Man, now I don't want to look it up so I can't keep my mental image. <laughs> hmm. 
Not even close. Oh no. Yeah, let me draw their hand, you know, their hands together. It'll be easy, says I. Said I. Not really realizing my foolish. <laughs> my fool's errand. Yeah, one thumb would be on top of the other. Well, it's gonna look jank for a second. Scuffed, I should say. This is gonna look scuffed for a hot second. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad, actually. Just gotta move his arm a little. Let's see. There we go. I guess... No. should be fine. Okay, I'm like getting super focused right now. Yeah, I want to hug Ming Kunmon so much. He's so cute. Oh, I do know which one you're talking about. Aw, oh, dude. I want to hug Lopmon. That's the one Digimon I would love to hug the most. Adamon. Oh crap. I got so into the conversation. I forgot to finish my evening stuff. Be back in a bit. Whoops. This is gonna be scuffed, and that's just gonna have to be okay. You know, I actually did one, but are from Kirby? No way. Looking that up. But at the same time, I think I kind of know what you're talking about. Yes. I remember hearing about this bottom one.
They do look like Kirby. Kirby, oh, Kirby Dream Land 3 is when they first were introduced. That's wild. Okay, I'm gonna have to look up my own freaking art to figure out how to draw this Dracomon like. No. DeviantArt. Take me to DeviantArt. Oh, it was forever ago. Dude, I drew Dracomon so differently from last time I drew him. Oh my gosh, so I'm about to show you guys. I drew this back in 2020. I honestly kind of prefer how I drew it that time. Okay, bam. This is how I drew Dracomon back in 2020. And I was doing soft shading? What the heck? That's wild. And this is how I'm drawing Dracomon now. So I still had no idea what I was doing with legs. Gotcha. Wait, he's got back spikes on his leg? Hold up. No way. He doesn't. Oh, that's not a spike. That's more of the net. Oops. Dude, yeah, I'm drawing him so differently now. That's wild. Bigger head. Right? Wild. I'll reduce the size of the body just a smidge. One more layer! One more layer! Thingies. That's a lot harder than it looks. I think I just did it. Maybe? I don't know. Now I'm getting like hyper focused, guys. We will finish this tonight. Hold up. Okay, yeah.
I guess. I don't know. Digimon feet are weird. <laughs> that, and they're never really consistent with how they draw their Digimon either. Like, there's like freaking. I'm looking at three different Dracomon thingies right now. Like, uh, references. I'm looking at three different Dracomon references. So just like, please. I just need to know how to draw this freaking Digimon real quick. That looks fine. Alright, and now we can't forget the vegetables that you're supposed to be carrying. another potato. Like I said, I know that it's supposed to be in a wheat field, but it's kind of whatever at this point. Also a carrot as well. His feet are way too small for his little body. This looks scuffed. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad. It's like, I don't know, do another turn up on this side as well. Dude, that foot looks so scuffed. Ah, oh, man, I wish... I had a better look at his feetsies. Because a lot of the references I'm looking at is, like, bad. 
Maybe I should just draw how I understand they should be drawn. Before I do another hello, sup living. Before I do another charity thing, I need to practice how to draw uh, Dracomon in particular. That looks better, actually. And good enough. What am I doing? Copying and pasting, that's what I'm doing. Is there a reason you choose Dragomon and Kramer and both of those images? Um, I think it was just. the time i was very obsessed with both of them and i'm like man i just want to draw them again and it like i ended up making them like my regular go-to choices whenever i do this collab now so whenever uh the charity guild is like hey collab time i'm like hey dracomon and cramorant i think it's really only because i like them so much go good enough i think not really Ooh, no. you ever drew a monster hunter monster oh. have i i have um where's my twitter at and show up i haven't drawn a lot of them i've done a few commissions for monster hunter monsters um, I still have one doodle somewhere of that Rathalos that was turning out really good that I need to finish. Oh, bro, I need to... Oh, thanks for the link to my own Twitter, Nabu. I need to actually, uh, finish that, and I need to actually practice more Monster Hunter art. Here's one I did. I'm just gonna put this on a new... Ugh. Okay. Here's one I did for Valentine's. It was okay. I did. Thanks, Nabu. There's one I did. And then where's another one? I guess I've only drawn a little bit. I've drawn more uh, Monster Hunter stories related characters. Here's a commission I did. You know, someone wanting their character on the back of a Silverwind Nargakuga. <laughs> Let's see. Hold on. I can do this a nicer way. Instead of putting it on my freaking canvas like a dingus. Here's a Nergigante I did for my sister's birthday because my sister actually really likes Monster Hunter as well. There's that commission I did. 
Where's that other one? The Rathalos bit. I did this Rathalos for Valentine's. Oh, where is another one? I did a couple other ones. Oh, yes. I did this Rathalos for fun. Oh, that's a big boy. When I was first trying to practice drawing Rathalos. There's that one. Oh, and then I was commissioned to do a Legiacris, and that was a fun time. Bam. The guy curse one actually turned out really good. I hand did all those scales, by the way. <laughs> Not to toot my own horn or anything, but I did all those scales by hand because I'm a psycho. Okay, but Legiacris is actually really fun to do because, like, the uh, scales here, right? On his little feetsies were fun. I don't know. It was just a good old time with the Legai Chris. I need to do more Monster Hunter art. Oh gosh, but that's like a stream and a half, bro. If I was to do Monster Hunter art on stream, oh, it'd take forever. It's already 8.30 and I'm not done with uh, these two. Imagine if I tried to do a stream of Monster Hunter art. Oh gosh. Okay, you can't forget Dracomon's wings. What? <laughs> what are I doing? Hold on, I need the reference back up for the boyo. Oh, that's how his lane wings look? What the heck? We need to make them on another layer. I forgot to also show off that one Rathalos doodle. Uh, it's kind of lost right now. Not like permanently, but it's in that big old folder where everything is like pretty disorganized and stuff. So, <laughs> I gotta go dig for it and finish it. Just about ready to do the line art. And you know, if I- okay, if I said I'm not going to do vector lines for this, are you guys going to call me a psycho? <laughs> I know Namu's going to be like, hmm? <laughs> what do you mean you're not going to use vector lines? Busts out the bat. 
Well, I want to kind of try and do this without vector lines. I'm sorry. Okay? Sorry. Shrimpin'. Anything else? I did say I was gonna put them in a, uh, dang, no more eyeball physics. I know. No more googly eyes. Sorry. Gonna pocket and I told you so. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, you probably. I don't know, just the way I do line art, the way I feel comfortable doing line art, it just doesn't work with vector lines. I'm sorry, Nana. I might do vector lines on certain parts, right? But I still desire to be a bit of a psycho, apparently. Oh yeah, we also have to do Little T first. Right? Wait, how does this T first look? Stop! <laughs> Wait! Where's. Where's. Right there. How does this front T first look? Oh, not like that? Okay, good to know. go. Just need to get some teefers in his mouth. Do I want to do one more pass of sketch, or do I want to just go straight into line art from this? Uh, let's see. No, I'm gonna do one more pass of sketch, so I don't know what the heck I'm doing. That's a big carrot, I actually realized. Yeah, let me do one more pass with the sketch layers. So I can do some corrections real quick here, now instead of later. And then we will go into uh, line art. For example, I want to... Fix up... Cramorant's head a little more. My life advice to all of you guys is that you can never have enough, uh, sketch layers. Never. Big freaking carrot. Gotta change that.
you. <laughs> I do feel though at some point my like sketch like I can't like for some reason make the sketch look any better I don't know and it starts looking a little worse that j might just be me as well. Oh my gosh! Do you want to see a Tiger X I made while I was at school? Oh, heck yeah! Um, send that to us in the Discord, bro. You thought I forgot? I did not. <laughs> I would never forget. And there you go. Join the Discord if you haven't. Show this on stream. Living. <laughs> Please let me know if I'm allowed to show that on stream. Yes? Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's perfect! Oh my gosh, my cheeks hurt. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh my gosh, he's perfect. Bro, thank you for sharing. What a precious baby boy. <laughs> okay, we're about to move on. <laughs> what a precious baby boy. We're about to move on to... Feel I feel reinvigorated thanks to that. Thank you, Livin. But anyway, what am I saying? We're about to move on to line art. Like I said, just going to clean up the sketch a little so I know what I'm doing a little better. I actually want to make that a little bigger. I'll, I'll keep it like that. I think it looks a lot better if I just include these ones.
go. Cramorant's almost all cleaned up. Before we do line art, I am going to take a quick little break to break just to stretch out my hand before we get into... say something and I forgot. Oh! I forgot to tell you guys, I started playing the new Nino Cooney game that's on the phone. Smile. And it's alright. Um, yeah, it's on the phone only and it was made by Netmarble, which I think is a pretty famous phone game company. Uh, at least I know a lot of a lot of games by Nintendo Marvel. Don't ask me what though because I can't remember at this point. I don't know, is this Kramer looking okay? No. This part is not looking okay. Much better now. A bit, bit more separation in the back. But yeah, it, it's okay, but I got some gripes. Do you guys like when classes are locked to races, I guess? Because I know, right? Not, not just race, even. So in the world of Nino Kuni, you got merfolk, you got animal people, and you got like half animal people, you know, cat girls and dog boys and stuff and then you got people people i think you got like elves as well or like druid folk or something but yeah there's like by the way the tiger x has a black background because the score doesn't like my transparent images oh yeah weird but nah totally understandable no worries that's what I figured, anyway. It was because it had a transparent background. But yeah, so I wanted to obviously make a cat girl, right? And I wanted a cat girl healer. What file type are you saving it as? I think that's directed as you, to you, Livin. Because if it's a JPEG, JPEGs don't like transparent backgrounds in general. I'm pretty sure. Right? PNGs are what you want to send if you want to send a transparent background but if you are in fact going to post it online don't you don't do it don't post your pngs online guys always had them as uh, low quality jpegs so that people try <laughs> because if people try to steal your art they're dumb and they're stealing the low quality version of your art I don't know, is this Kramer looking okay? I really can't tell. No. No, it's not. Okay, I actually gotta figure out how to do the duck foot. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, Nino Kuni's got uh, the game on the phone now, but it's really weird with how it does the character creation. You can't pick any of the neat little races they have in Nino Kuni. You can only pick like certain character characters. It's weird, like character presets, and then you could kind of customize them, but only barely. So I wanted to pick the healer class in uh, Nino Kuni Cross Worlds is the full name of it. And it's some little, like, 10-year-old chick. And I'm like, mm, no, I really don't want to play as a 10-year-old child in this game, you know? But the class was locked to this character preset. And I'm like, all right, Nino Kuni, or whoever does freaking the Nino Kuni games. No, my wall. 
Like, alright guys, that's kind of stupid. You have like, they have merfolk even. They have like fish people. And you can't like even pick those. I feel like it was such a missed opportunity. It's such a weird thing for them to do. It's like, why? Why would you do that? All right, I'm feeling uh, not confident. Liar. There we go. All right, now we can go to line art. That, and I was surprised to see that the new Nino Kuni game wasn't a gotcha until it showed me that it was a gotcha. And I'm like, oh, okay, that's actually not that bad. You know, probably just pay for cosmetics and stuff. I mean, hey, that's pretty all right. Um, and then I saw the part where it was a gotcha, and I'm like, no. Why? All right, like I said before, I switch over. I'm going to stretch out my hand and I'll complain about this game <laughs> that I'm still playing because it, it's actually kind of cute. But yeah, you can have familiars in this game, but to get familiars, it's a gotcha, baby. That, and I think weapons, though you can craft some weapons, I don't know. I do like the familiar aspect of it, like having cute little like Pokemon companions. I'm always a sucker for games like that. What was weird for me, though, is that the game, like, almost plays itself. It's kind of weird. Like, it can auto-walk you over to quests and stuff. And at first, I was like, I don't know how to feel about that. It's kind of not me playing this game. But then, I was working. <laughs> I was working on stuff for the stream while I had that game playing in the background. I'm like, okay, I think this game is for me. <laughs> Th this is fine. Like, it even, like, has your character auto-fight monsters and stuff. If, it, if it's part of a quest. And I was kind of, like, weirded out by that at first. But because I'm so busy, right? And I'm like... Okay, this isn't as bad. So I can forgive you for now. So yeah, um... If you want to give Nido Kuni Cross World a try, it's cute. It's got that Studio Ghibli vibe in it still. Uh, the voice acting's cute. The characters are cute. The premise is cute. I give it a cute out of cute. No, my party horn! No. Okay, I rescued it. And I stretched out my hand, and we can continue the line art. <sighs> Guys, I'm so glad to be back on my computer, actually. As much as it was nice to be working on my iPad as like a backup, none of my brushes were working the same. Like for example, this brush here, for some reason was not working the same way as it was supposed to on the iPad. And that was actually driving me up the wall while I was trying to work on, uh, what was it, Bluefin's commission? Because a bluefin commissioned me to draw something. And then I have another thing I need to work on. That I'm just probably going to work on. On my own time. Oh, heck yeah. Like, not even my sketch brush was working the same. And that was, like, driving me crazy, dude. Go ahead and pull up a new 
view for this. It's happening, Namu. I am not using vector lines. <laughs> I can feel it, guys. Namu is angry with me. He's gonna bully me later. Like, bro. Why aren't you using vector lines? He's gonna bust out the bat. Oh, yeah, and he's also gonna make me work on my VTuber. Because <laughs> I did ask him to do that part. Thanks, Namu. <laughs> Please be kind, Namu. I'm sorry. I'll, like, try to do a mix and match of vector lines and, you know, not vector lines. Why does this eyeball look jank? Now it's fine. It's fine. Just bust out the bat. Bat all day, every day. <laughs> no, right now I'm too busy de being angry with the project I'm working on. Only so much angry to go around. <laughs> oh no! Sorry to hear, mate. Hopefully, it's not too bad. Monster Hunter Monster should I make a low effort version of uh Nargakuga next if you haven't done one yet. No, I take that back. Have you done a Zenogre yet, Livid? So if, you, if not, I would love to see you do a Zenogre. Done as you know. Oh, dang it. Uh, I got it. Young Garaga. Do a low effort version of Young Garaga. You gotta give him angry eyebrows. That's my only request. Give If you do Young Garaga, give him angry eyebrows. You can do the I told you so! <laughs> Cause I gotta move this eyeball!
<laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh no. Nami was right, guys. It's okay, it was an easy fix. But Nami can definitely tell me I told you so. He has he has provision. Man, plugging up a deformic shapes is so easy with <laughs> it. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> Oh man, that's right everyone, Nami was right, I was wrong. I was like, oh, I don't need vectors for this, it'll be fine. I need vectors for this. Isn't this from Crystal Shards? This song? Or maybe I'm having the music too low again to where you guys can't even hear it. Which, you know, is kind of standard at this point. Nah, music is good volume right now. Oh, okay, good. That's a first. Actually looking pretty sick, not gonna lie. My boy, Dracomon. Now I'm gonna get another I told you so. Probably. Yes. I gotta move stuff around again. Oh man, I'm sorry, Nami. I'm sorry, me. I really was confident in thinking, oh man, I don't need vector lines for this. I got it. <laughs> It's been sent. <laughs> yes, perfect. I love that you emphasized his big old jaw, his big old shovel chin. Oh man, it makes me want to draw a young Garaga. Because this is one of my favorite, like, little monsters. Not, I wouldn't say little monsters. It's one of my favorite monsters. Along with the Camellios and the Snowbird. 
<laughs> it's beautiful. Got any more? Oh. I think. Durham Boros. Do a low effort Durham Boros. Everybody's doing art tonight, team. You know, I don't actually like where that connects on the head. <laughs> Man, now I'm just gonna get a lot of I told you so's tonight. I have to move more stuff around. Bro. I swear, I just didn't... It, I did not feel like doing vector lines tonight. And the feeling was wrong. I'm sorry. I'm sincerely sorry, Naman. I wish I would have given them some sort of hat. Oh well. <sighs> Once we get the line art done, coloring and shading it is going to be pretty quick. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Actually, going to derail the stream, guys. Hold on. There's a, there's a thing I need to find on the uh, Clip Studio Asset Store. By the way, anybody who's using Clip Studio, they're giving away, I think, 2,000 Clippy tomorrow in celebration for their 10 year anniversary. <gasps> Ooh. Also, they're going to add a couple more features that we're gonna check out together on stream when I do another art stream and they actually add the features. Um. While I'm looking, I'm going to stretch out my hand and then use my left hand to click the mouse. And not uploads, downloads. Because there's a certain brush. I oh gosh, excuse me. I think I showed it off to you guys before in the Discord. I was super excited to try it out and now it's time. It's time to try it out. Yes. Here, I'll swing my um. Nah, this should be fine. I'll, I'll show you guys. Maybe. Hold on, let me look at Digimon. We'll see. We'll see if this will be an okay brush to use for the shading, or to help with some of the shading. Because I'm actually trying to do more of a, a different bit with my shading. Let me see. Uh, let me open up the King BDD thing I did recently. Or not. Psych. Uh, where is it? Oh, I have to open it. Because I saved it on the cloud because we're not doing that dance. Song and dance again. Uh, where everything is 100% scuffed and I don't have access to any of my art. But yeah, so I kind of, for my shading now, I want to include kind of a halftone bit, as you can see. Oh, this one turned out so cute, guys. I'm sorry. Don't mean to toot my own horn, but I am very happy how this one turned out. But yeah, I want to include kind of like a halftone in my shading for now on. We'll see how that goes. But for the Digimon bit, I want to try something different. I'm downloading the brush right now as we speak, I think. Right? Oh, no! I have to organize all my brushes again! No! Hold on, 
I'm gonna lean back. I actually had to take a breath there. So, remember when I said this computer was brand sparkly new? And I said, oh man, I'm gonna try and organize all my brushes into folders, Lamau. And then the universe proceeded to say, psych Lamau, and nuked my whole computer. So now all of the folders that I had where I was organizing all of these brushes, brushes, textures, stuff, and things. Oh, that's not even all of them. Look at all that, look at all that, look. All of those used to be in folders, guys. All of these used to be in folders, and now they're not! <laughs> so yeah, I gotta go and take some time, probably this weekend, guys, and I gotta organize all my brushes again. Again. <laughs> not again. Here's one potato. Here's another potato. So yeah, that's gonna be f a fun weekend for me. Where I gotta go and organize all my brushes. Thankfully, I have Clip Studio in working order. All I really need are my sketch and line art brush. And I'm pretty, pretty set. Hey, I'm gonna use vector lines, Namu! Because there's no freaking way. Oh, that was actually perfect. Why? Okay, that one wasn't. So now we're gonna do vector lines. See? Clip Studio materials are such a blessing and curse. It's great to have... Great that there's so many resources, but there's so many. Yeah, I know, right? There's too many. Pinch. Uh-oh. That's not right. There we go. Ish. Nope. I have actually mastered the technique of the pinch tool, I will say. Okay, hold on, I need a freaking, <laughs> I need another thing of a turnip. Okay. Dude, what happened? This actually looks so good, wow. Gosh, my art actually looks pretty okay so far. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like really impressed with myself right now. Dang. Alright, let me lower the opacity. Just smidge. I do want... The turnip leaves on this other turnip here to not be in the way. Wait, nope. Okay, I'm gonna move 
these up. There we go. Alright, I sent the thing. You did another one? Dang, bro, you're fast. <laughs> I love him. I hope they bring back Durham Boros in a Monster Hunter Subway. He's beautiful. You should be proud. He's a beautiful boy. Oh my gosh, my cheeks hurt. Oh my gosh, bro. It's brilliant. Okay. Let me, let me get back to this. Oh my gosh. Okay. What is my eraser set to? Oh my gosh. Actually. Nice. Alright. So I'm gonna use a mix, Namu. I hope we can come to that happy middle of where I use a mix of vector. <laughs> And regular, because holy crap, that was awful. Man, I need to fix that, like, right now. I'm probably gonna try and do that for now on, where I do a mix of, um, vector lines and... Uh, what am I saying? I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Still sus! <laughs> No, you're sus! Tell me how my technique is sus! You're sus! Mm, go back to not using vector lines. Meh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, how do I draw this? There's a gnat! Ah, my eyes. Now that's a fly. Shove off. Come on. You're in the way. Come on, shove off. Get out of here. Okay. kind of looks like turnip leaves. I don't know if I like to eat turnips. Does anyone in chat like to eat turnips? Like, you can't eat turnips by... I mean, you can! Oh, oh, let me correct that. You can eat turnips by themselves, right? But I don't know if turnips by themselves are actually good. Right? Does a turnip... Okay. Does a turnip taste like an onion? Or am I actually wrong? Like, 100% wrong in that fact. In that statement, I should say. What do turnips taste like? Guys. Inquiring minds would like to know. I am going to eat this fly. Fly in my face one more time, son, and you're gone. You will cease to exist on this plane of existence, okay? I never had a turnip, but if they taste like onions, I'm out. Okay, onions are okay if you, like, saute them, right? If onions are cooked a certain way, I don't mind them. But onion rings and, like, onions by themselves are, like... Okay, am I crazy, or do people, like, serve raw onions on burgies, or do they have to cook them? Because I swear to goodness, a lot of times when I get an onion in my burg, it's, I swear, like, a raw onion. Or some 
crazy thing like that. And I'm like, that's disgusting. <laughs> that can't... No, I hate it. Okay, that's it. Come here, you. Dude, get off my screens. Please. Oh, yeah. I also don't know where that spider went to weeks ago. If you guys remember about that bit. What were we talking about? Oh yes, onions. Like I said, if they're uh, not by themselves, I don't mind them. But if it's an onion by itself, like onion rings, depends on the onion ring, I should say. I've had some onion rings that I've been okay with. And I've had onion rings where I'm like not okay with. Yeah, okay, no, I'm curious now. What does a turnip taste like? What does a turnip taste like? Raw turnips turn sweet, nutty, and earthy when cooked. They're mildly spicy when raw. Guys, I think I need to buy a turnip. <laughs> because I I want to know what they taste like. You know what I mean? I've never eaten one, and I kind of want to see what they taste like. Oh, heck. That's not what I meant to do. Stop. Stop. Oh no, I told you guys I'm doing a time lapse of this, right? Hold up. How wonk is this time lapse gonna be? Is it gonna show the bits where I copy and pasted stuff? Oh no, it just might. Alright, for future reference, I'm. Oh, no, there it was. Wait, where'd the other ones go? Huh. I only saw the Nargakuga. Alright, cancel. I just wouldn't know what to even do with one. I've never had a recipe called for turnips. Seven creative ways to cook turnips. Okay, let's look into it. What can we use turnips for? Creative ways. I'm going to eat this fly. Bro! <laughs> turnips and fried eggs? Fry small diced turnips in a cast iron skillet for a hash topped with fried eggs. Turnips. Pickled turnips. I've heard that's a thing. Like, that's like the most common. Mashed turnips. For winter vegetable food comfort, swap mashed potatoes for sweet mashed turnips alongside a rich braised meat main. How do you roast a turnip? I'm gonna ask my husband if he can cook something with a turnip in it, and I'll let you know if it's gross or not. I'm kind of- I kind of want to like turnips, though. Thank you! Thank you! Oh gosh, it's 
Excuse me. Speaking of Nagakuga, look at Discord. Oh my gosh, did you do an Nagakuga? <laughs> yes, you did. It's cute. Okay, I'm gonna get back to drawing, though, because I do want to get this done so I can work on the VTuber. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like I'm gonna be able to work on it tonight. I'm so sorry, guys. I will send you, like, progress videos if you guys don't mind that while I'm working on her. But I was pretty confident I was, <laughs> I was gonna get this done. I should stop being confident in that. And just realize, uh, no, your streams are usually scuffed, and <laughs> you need to stop being confident <laughs> in the idea that you might be able to finish this during stream. So that is, unfortunately, not being the case. my nose. Okay, the claw also needs to be shown here, I think. Yeah, there, we go. there we go. Dang, guys, that actually looks pretty okay. And I'm gonna have a time lapse to boot. Oh no, Namu, I gotta do the VODs actually as well. Namu, bully me into doing the VODs. Because those need to start getting. They, those need to start getting sent out. The VODs do. I need to find uh, the little template I had for the VODs, and I need to do those. Heck, VODs! Yeah! I thankfully was able to save everything. Yes. I was able to save everything off of Twitch. So I have all the VODs before, uh, you know, the computer got nuked. So I need to catch up on the VOD. <sighs> oh no. Do I actually want to work on the VODs, guys? I think the VODs are actually cursed. <laughs> Because I was, in fact, working on the VODs last time. Uh, or I was working on the VODs, and then the computer decided... Psych. <laughs> no VODs for you. Oh, no. So I think the VODs are kind of cursed, guys, and they make me kind of nervous. Oh, God. I don't know what to do. Because the VODs need to get done. So then we have like an archive of all my streams. Right? But I'm actually uh, slightly terrified of the VODs. Because, you know, they seem you know, a smidge cursed. I don't know what to do. Alright, um, I've been streaming for how many hours? Three hours? My husband has been taking a three hour nap. And I know it's probably cruel, but I gotta wake him up or he's not gonna be able to sleep at all tonight. So I'm gonna be right back real quick. And hopefully nothing is scuffed.
I am so sorry, Basho. <laughs> Your timing was pretty great. I'm so sorry. Welcome. Welcome to the stream, Basho. I hope you all are doing good this wonderful Wednesday night. Yeah? Wait, it's Wednesday, right? Yes, it's Wednesday. You're welcome. But yeah, so if you're wondering what we're doing, I am working on a thing for charity right now. Uh, on DeviantArt, there is a... No need to be sorry. <laughs> Your timing was really funny, though. I, I did have to wake husband from nap. Her husband was going to be up all night. But, um, what was it saying? Uh, so there's a charity guild. <laughs> I'll explain while we derail the stream. I need to find a new song. I have officially mastered... Not really. I mastered the song once I memorized the song. But, uh, okay. Well, I'm setting up the saxophone. So there's a charity guild on DeviantArt called charity guild run by username tommy gk and he is currently doing a charity collaborate like an art collab a charity art collab that i'm working on right now i'm working on my part and i am drawing dracomon from digimon and cramorant from pokemon No! My baby! Not again. What happened? Why you do this? Stop it. Okay, it should be good now. There we go. It's good. The baby's good. Okay, so... What's wrong with the saxophone, you might be wondering. I think, for some reason... So, in order to hit, like, high notes on the saxophone, right? So, for example, this is a low G. And then this is a high G. There's a key you have to press in order to reach that high note. And the key that you press lifts this like lever or what, I don't know how to explain it really, it's kind of weird. But essentially what's happening right now is that for some odd reason, it is not closing all the way. The little like thingy that helps me do the low and high notes or the high notes essentially. For some reason, is no longer wanting to close all the way. I've had this issue in the past before, not with this saxophone, but with a different saxophone. When I was playing in a band and stuff. Okay, let me go pull out the instrument online. I gotta just have this on a online instrument tuner so we can tune the bad boy and then we can play the final fantasy oh perfect but yeah i need to find a different song for us uh and i got rid of it again we gotta find some more sheet music so we can play a different song. No! No! That was so scuff! Why? Why? Why scuff? Why? Why'd you do that? Why'd you make me look bad? 
Why? Why? Hold up. No. Uh-oh. What's wrong? What's wrong, baby boy? What's wrong? Is something being pressed when I sit? No more chair. I stand up and play. I'm standing up. Okay, this might sound crazy, but I do actually have a spare saxophone. <laughs> Did I tell you guys I have two saxophones? So, I actually got this saxophone that I'm using from a pawn shop for 75 buckaroos. Because it was a Yamaha. And Yamahas are actually really- what's happening to it? Something is not closing the way it's supposed to. I wish I could show you guys what, but uh, that defeats the whole purpose of me not showing my face online. It's you. I think I might have fixed it. Oh, I fixed it! Wah! I fixed it. what the problem is I could try sending some pictures on the discord <laughs> what is happening to my stream <laughs> what is going on but um it's I think you would call it the neck of the saxophone is what helps you play the higher notes and for some reason, it's kind of scuffed right now. There's a lot of parts that go to a saxophone, which is kind of bad. You know, hold on. It. But yes, join the Discord if you haven't. But yeah, so the bit that's supposed to help me play the higher notes is giving me a bit of trouble. And like I've said, I've had this problem in the past with a previous saxophone. And the only way to fix it is if you know what you're doing. <laughs> Okay, that's good. Blue. Rika. <gasps> Blue! Sup, my dude? Sup, mate? That's some funky beats. Well, my child is dying right now. My poor baby boy saxophone is trying to die on me. But I won't let it. <laughs> Is it? 
No, I fixed that. I fixed the sticky note. Yeah, it wasn't that hard. Uh, it wasn't oiled. But this, like I was explaining, so the neck, right? There's this little like, what what would you call this? A valve. There we go. There's a valve on the neck of the saxophone that's supposed to be pressed or go up when I'm trying to play a higher note. Okay, I think it's okay now. I think I fixed it. <laughs> but sometimes it just happens. I don't know, man. Oh, yeah. Okay, no more derailed stream. We get back to work. <laughs> My next commission. <gasps> Ooh. Draw every po. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna go lie on the floor real quick. <laughs> Bro, there's like almost 900 Pokemon. Does it have to be on a single canvas? <laughs> Oh gosh, there's almost 900 Pokemon, right? After this game, I'd add another 50 if they're drawn in poker rap order. <laughs> do they still do the poker rap? They don't do the pokey rap anymore? That's a crime, dude. I don't have the first pokey rap memorized though. I'm sorry, I'm a fake fan. Need it done by tomorrow. I missed that part. I had to I had to lie on the floor. <laughs> oh man. Imagine if you were commissioned to draw every single Pokemon. How many Pokemon? Full stop. How many Pokemon are there? How many? Pokemon are there just in general oh gosh there is already 900 905 Pokemon right now that's a lot of Pokemon that's a lot of Pokemon Oh my gosh. I've seen people do like posters though, of like generations of Pokemon, and those are really neat. See? I think it pushes 1000 if you count forms. Okay, if we don't count forms though. It's only 905. But I don't know if that includes the new new Pokemon, which I cannot remember their names. <sighs> what are the names of the new starters? I can't remember. Hold up. No, I can't remember. I should let you all know what I'm drawing for anybody new who just came in. I'm doing a charity thing. Uh, I'm doing a charity collab. I might actually be moving after all. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> I'm too powerful! I have to have these taken away from me.
New apartment is a lot nicer and way more space. Oh, dude. So hopefully it all, all goes through. I really hope it does for you, bro. I really do. Because I'll let you in on a little secret, guys. Our apartment that we're living in right now is small. It really is. We're, we're trying to find somewhere else. Anywhere else. Right? But it's taking a bit. And it sucks, but... Yeah. How many square foot? Hey, honey. How many square foot? is his apartment. Huh? I know. I know. A thousand square feet all around? A little bit more than that. Thousand three hundred square foot. It's small. Four? Oh gosh. That's right, guys. Secrets out. I am a tiny fairy person. And I live in a tiny house. A very, very tiny house. But no, our apartment's small. It's got an upstairs, a downstairs, and then a bathroom. And that's like it. It's small. Basically, uh, it just has a ground floor and upstairs. It's got a ground floor and an upstairs. I live in a 700 foot one at the moment. Yeah? Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Right? But, okay. Um, our apartment was basically a... H honey, what would you say it was? It was a carriage house. A carriage house. If you don't know what a carriage is? Oh, well, you guys know what a carriage is. But, uh, our apartment was a garage slash carriage house that was then turned into an apartment oh it was only just a carriage house the carriage house that someone tried to turn into like their what like man house a man cave like place i don't know oh excuse me I'm getting stuffy. Oh shoot, I forgot to pick up more Mucinex today. But yeah, however big a carriage house is, it, it really, it's nice because it's close to everything. Like it's close to like, Essentials and stuff. I'm trying not to dox myself here. It's in walking distance of everything we need. And it's a short walk. Right? But, like... Proximity is nice. Yes, proximity is nice. That's why we liked it at first. But it's... It's all right. It's not. It, it's no longer what we want, though. We. I honestly need my own office. <laughs> you know. I honestly need my own office. Husband needs his own office. We we just want more room. Just a just enough room, you know. So hopefully. Uh, we'll be able to move here because uh, my my parents are actually trying to help us with something, but <sighs> now it's not on them. It's on the how you say the courthouse taking forever to do paperwork and stuff. So honestly, it's nothing that we can do, and it really sucks. Yeah. They all need offices and dog needs room to run. Oh, dude, yeah. Like, we take her to the dog park and stuff, right? The main reason why I'm moving. I'll have a fully dedicated room for computer and stuff. That's what I need. I love but hate that my 
bed is right next to my computer. <laughs> because the temptation is so much. It's a lot to just go and take a nap. <laughs> You know. Alright, we're almost done with Dracomon. Like, and that, and I heard it's not good either to have, like, uh, your bed and your office stuff in the same room. Like, it's bad for your sleep. What are y'all doing with the courthouse, if you don't mind me asking? Oh, no, I don't mind. So, my dad is trying to help us get our own house right um it was my grandmother's house she unfortunately passed away a couple years back no worry i'm i'm good i'm good about that now she unfortunately passed away and my dad is trying to help us with getting her house because I love my grandma, but she did not take care of her house. And so we agreed to move in and make the house all good and stuff again. Like, work on the house and stuff. Not only that, my parents would love to have us live closer to them, you know? And I, I wouldn't mind living closer to them either, so I can actually see my parents and stuff more often. Because we live a little ways away. You know. So yeah, my dad just needs... I oh, know, not courthouse. What was it? With his lawyer or something. Oh. So, are they trying to turn it over to y'all in name? Yes, it. We are going to buy the house from my dad. Which I thought was honestly fair enough. You know, I don't know. I just feel weird just being given a house. I don't know. I don't know. That sounds weird, but it's true. We were like, okay, yeah, we will go ahead and buy this house from you. I don't know. But it, it's just, we're just waiting for your paperwork to get filed and get through. I'm sure your grandma would love that. Yeah. Oh, man. When I was a little, little lass. I would, uh, my grandma would actually pick me up from school because there was an elementary school right next to her house. And so while my parents were busy working, she would come and pick me up. Oh man, I remember she would always make me PB&J sandwiches. And she knew that I hated the crust on sandwiches. And so she would cut the crust off and she would also make the PB&J sandwiches into like little bite-sized thingies. It was so, it was so adorable. I loved it. And she would also collect a bunch of little Pokemon figurines for me. And I remember she would, like, she had, like, a toy box full of, like, Pokemon figurines and stuff. And she'd be like, alright, remember all the blue Pokemons, go back here when you're done. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, it was great memories. And it really does break my heart to see her house um, in the state it's in. So I'm glad we'll be able to move in and make it all good and stuff again. Because uh, it's not going to be like our forever home, you know. What's wrong with it? Oh, gosh. <laughs> what isn't wrong with it? Um... There's a couple busted windows. I don't know how they're busted. I think, uh... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yes. It's... It's scuffed, dude. It, it's, it's pretty scuffed. Um, busted windows on, like, the uh, basement level. I think someone ran over a rock with a mower. And that happened. Which is freaking awesome, dude. Uh, what else? There's an unfinished back porch. Like, I think my grandma paid somebody to finish the porch, and then they never finished it. 
Uh, what else? It might mean a new, um, heating and cooling unit. What else? The outside looks a little rough, too. I don't know if it needs a power wash or what. I'm not really, I'm not really an expert. But the outside looks pretty rough. Um, the stairs to the front door need some work. Because they're starting to fall apart. How old is the house? No idea, dude. I had no clue. I think it needs new carpets. Like, it just needs a, a bit of, um, TLC. Is that, what, is that how you say that? TLC? I'd be careful with the roof, too. Oh, yeah, no. I, that's something I thought about as well. I wish I could help you guys with working on it. Aw, thanks, Blue. I learned a lot about that stuff from my dad. And I love to do that kind of stuff. Bro, my husband, or my or father-in-law. I can say father-in-law. I keep forgetting I can say father-in-law. My father-in-law was actually a carpenter. And my husband would go and help him with stuff. So thankfully, we're not going in too, um, too blind. So husband knows a little bit here and there. That, and thankfully my dad is also pretty handy with stuff too. And he's offered to help with, uh, touching up stuff around the house. I'll be getting that working. <laughs> Heck yeah. But yeah, no, thankfully my uh, family will be able to help when they can, so. How many rooms does it have? Let's see, it's got a kitchen. The rooms are kind of tiny too, but that's okay. It's better than... <laughs> it's honestly better than this place. Let's see, it's got a kitchen, living room, two bedrooms, one bathroom, and a basement. I don't know if it has an attic. It's been a hot minute. Well, the basement's pretty spacious. Oh no, I'm full of junk. Sorry, Grandma. <laughs> Sorry, Grandma. My Grandma did collect a lot of stuff. Could make the basement the computer area. I already said husband can make the basement his man cave. If I get it, like, if I can have the second bedroom as an office, I'm good. That works too. Yeah. I'm, I'm totally chill with husband making basement into man cave. As long as I get the spare. Oh gosh. Bedroom. As my own little office. Oh, dude, and it has a nice backyard. That's the one thing I'm really excited about. Because we're planning on fencing in the whole backyard. Hope it all gets worked out. Me too, because we've been waiting for, like, maybe more than a year now. Oh, thanks to COVID. So. Hopefully things just, you know. Stop being scuffed. Honestly, and we can move closer to my family and, you know, actually be able to live in a house and not a very tiny apartment. Oh no, I gotta do another turnip. <laughs> no, not another turnip. 
Oh, and he needs more Tifers as well. But yeah, like, I'll let you guys know when that becomes more of a thing, yeah? Because right now, we've heard nothing. And I'm like, I've already got a lot to worry about on my end. Because the computer... Oh, man. With the computer having been nuked and getting all scuffed up. I have so... I got so much I gotta do. So, I'm not too worried about it. The house isn't going anywhere, honestly. So, we'll, we'll get news when we get news. I am more focused on trying to unscuff all the computer stuff. Because, uh, I need to reorganize the majority of my art. I gotta figure out what files are still corrupted. Because a couple of things got corrupted. Thanks to the M.2 uh, freaking out on me. Thankfully, though, I do actually have backups of a lot of my old art. Ooh, which I was super happy to find. So, it looks like all I need is art from 2022, and I should be pretty set. I just need to actually go through and organize everything that husband was able to pull off the M.2. Um... Oh, gosh, but... You missed it earlier. The stream was hyper scuffed because the drawing scene that we're on right now was not done. I had totally forgot that OBS was back to zero. Back to clean slate. Um, what else? What else is scuffed right now? Oh, gosh. All of my brushes, all of my how many brushes I have on uh, Clip Studio. All of these bad boys. All, there's so many brushes, guys. Look at that, that's so many brushes and textures and stuff. They were in folders. That's still wild that that happened. Oh, dude. Yeah, it freaking was. I'm like so unlucky for some reason. And then my uh, Discord got hacked too. Did I tell you guys also my Twitter apparently got hacked as well? But thankfully nothing too terrible happened on that front. Yeah, the Twitter even got hacked. I remember that well. Yeah, that was a freaking nightmare. That was- <laughs> that was scuffed, dude. Oh my gosh! Like, the universe wasn't done taking a dump in my Wheaties. Man. What else happened? Uh, what else happened? I don't know. It's just a lot of me trying to get back into the groove of things. Right now. After being gone for two weeks. And all that fun stuff. Oh, I do not like where that is. So I'm gonna move you over there. You... If Rika hasn't tried to scam you with hacks, are you in a part of the community? <laughs> message oh my gosh i got kicked out of so many groups because of that discord be nice be nice because of that discord junk dude i got banned from a couple of them too it's hyper scuffed hold on actually okay yeah i'm still in the groups that i honestly care about yeah. But yeah, I got kicked out of my old art professor's group. And he's a big, big time artist. I got kicked out of that group. Uh, I got kicked out of the Live 2D Discord server. And I tried to join back in and I got banned. Apparently. <laughs> what was it? Namu was like, oh, snap. What was it? Oh, it was for yesterday's stream. I was asking Namu if... He knew anywhere where I could get some free VTuber assets for the, uh, return stream. And he was like, oh wait, aren't you a part of that one Discord server? Uh, the Live 2D one? And I'm like, oh yeah! And I'm like, oh no, wait a minute, where'd it go? Where'd it go? 
And I'm like, oh, snap, bro. I think I got kicked out of that group because of the Discord uh, crap. And then Namu, the VTuber assets channel. Yes. And then Namu tried to send me a link to the server. And they were like, uh, Lamau, no, you've been banned. And I'm like, ah. Oh, of course. Just my luck. Just my luck. So, yeah. That happened. So I got banned from that group. I don't know if I got banned from my old art professor's group. And I'm kind of nervous to look. <laughs> uh... pretty scuffed that is the word of the day the word of the week actually scuffed oh i beat the mic um the good news though is i got the saxophone stand thanks to you guys shout out to y'all who helped me and funded the uh saxophone stand <laughs> oh gosh that's scuffed <laughs> There we go. So thank you, all of you. A special so uh, shout out to Blue. How's the chair though? Chair is amazing, Blue. Thanks, mate, for funding the chair. <laughs> it really is, it's so good. It's so nice to be able to sit in the chair. Heck yeah, chair hype, chair hype, chair hype. <laughs> It is really nice on my back when I actually lean back and not, uh, you know, shrimp. You guys gotta yell at me for shrimping again. Okay, now we gotta do the turnip leaves and then we can switch over to the cramorant and quickly color everything. Yes? Yes. And no, <laughs> that's stuff. Um, oh, and... Did I mention the, the the stream deck that I was able to get as well? Let's get shrimping. <clears throat> Let's get shrimping. I'm not shrimping anymore, I promise. But yes, I got me a stream deck. Just a, a, a little one. Because I was like, oh my gosh, like, oh, you got a stream deck? Nice. I know. <laughs> Shout out to Blue. I've heard those are hyped. Yes. Actually... I'm gonna take a picture. Uh, my soul is gonna leave my body for a second. All right, and I'll send that. I funded it, Lamau. You did. <laughs> Blue, you did. <laughs> you pretty much did, right? With, with all the support you've been giving the channel, bro. I don't... How did I come across the stream deck? Oh, it was when I... Please! Please, let me draw. But yeah, the stream deck was actually not that terribly expensive. Because I think there's like a stream deck XL and that thing is massive. And I was like, uh, no thanks. I don't have room on my desk for that. I don't know, no, I don't know what I'd use all that for. I wish I could show- <gasps> I can show you guys! I don't need to take a picture! Beep. Alright, here's my stream deck stuff. Moshi is using the pic you drew as their Twitter profile, by the way. I saw! Gave you credit in the bio. I saw, yay! I'm so happy they like it! But yeah, here's my, uh... Stream deck right now. But yeah, I saw. I've been seeing them on Twitter. I'm like, hee hee hee. Hold on, I gotta do the bit. Hee hee. I was so happy. I'm like, yay. I'm so glad they like it. But yeah. So the stream deck is set up like this so far. So I got my Clip Studio stuff that I still need to set up and remember what the heck all these do. But what I'm really using it for <laughs> is uh, the VTuber stuff. So as you can see, I got the goblin and the regular one here. And it's got all of my emotes and stuff. Which is really nice. 
And these icons do, in fact, display on the stream deck. Which is so cool, dude. But I also got this Twitter bit as well. Where, when I press the live, it will show on my Twitter profile that I'm live on Twitch. And I thought that was really neat. I don't know if I actually hit that button today. <laughs> this stream is honestly so scuffed. It is! I did press the button. But I thought that was really neat as well. But yeah, there's a lot you can do. And I actually thought about doing not a soundboard, but maybe like a voice changer thing. So I could do some funny things with my voice. Funny bits. Teehees. Super convenient. It is! And honestly, this is like the last big thing I'm gonna get for myself. I'm pretty set now when it comes to streaming. The rest goes into savings. Actually, that's a lie. The next big thing I want to be able to get, but I'm probably gonna hold off on, is a bigger desk. My desk is pretty tiny, and um... I'd like- I'd just like to be able to have a bit more room for my stuff. And I don't want to get me like a nice old big old desk. New desk hype? Eventually. Not in this apartment though. Because this apartment has slanted- <laughs> has slanted ceiling! So I can't actually get myself a nice desk because of this freaking ceiling. It sucks. So yeah, stream deck. Oh yeah, see, there is a voice mod. There's like a voice changer and stuff. There's a lot, actually. And I'm, I'm very happy that I was able to get this. I don't remember if it was on... I know the chair was on sale. So that's why I felt more confident in spoiling myself a little. <laughs> I did. But I did feel like spoiling myself a little. I hope you guys don't mind. You know. Because it is very convenient, and I need, need to actually uh, work on icons for uh, this one. This one's the Clip Studio. One. What is this? What does L do? I want the Stream Deck? Yeah! Because you can make your own icons. Like, I took these two off uh, the internet just real quick so I could label them... VTube Studio and there you spend money on this stream. Oh, oh, that's what you mean. Yeah, I'm sorry guys. I thought I could spoil myself just a smidge and give me a little stream deck. But uh I just need to get used to using it now. It's uh, it is really nice and I do thank y'all for supporting the stream. And now I got to stop derailing the stream. So that I could get stuff like this. No. But wait, what does L do? I set L as a thing and now I don't remember what it does. It's a lasso. I'm a dingus. I set that as the lasso tool. I'm so smart. Bruh, just be glad you don't have a throne wish list. I don't think we should tell Blue about the throne wish list. <laughs> uh oh. I actually do have a throne wish list, but I haven't actually found a lot of stuff on there that I. There's no link? Oh, snap, there's no link? I do have a throne wish list, though. And for some reason, there's no link? Weird. Let's see. Let me look at the channel and make it hyper channel. Stop. How do I link the throne wish list? It's a widget? Oh, uh, do I have to like link that? I've never seen 
it like that before? I thought you had it a list together. Yeah! I'd bother. Yeah, no, no, it's there. Yeah, yeah, Namu. Whoa, how much is that acoustic foam paneling? No. Hold up. Full stop. I might actually make a list because I don't think those <laughs> I don't think those are accurate. No, that's no way. Hold on, I gotta go on throne. I might just make it a list, or a link instead of a wish, uh, widget or whatever. If that's the more, um, common way. <laughs> yeah, they're missing a freaking dot. The widget made it look like the acoustic foam paneling was 2,000 buckaroos. Or I'm blind. And I'm like, mm, there's no freaking way. But yeah, I need to actually update the throne wish list because... Um, I haven't, like, touched it. You know what I mean? Like, I added the Kirby stuff just recently. <laughs> because I was like, ooh. Kirby stuff? Heck yeah. But I should honestly, like, look <coughs> through it. Japan card games. Ah, oh, heck yeah, time to derail the stream! I'd probably also put Pokemon cards on my wish list if they actually had packs. I don't want, like, a booster box or whatever the heck, right? Or maybe I do? I don't know. I'd probably put Pokemon cards on here as well. Because I, I also collect Pokemon cards. Aw, oh, dude. What if I turned this into a Pokemon card opening channel? Or whatever? That'd be funny. <laughs> I do need to organize my Pokemon cards, though. Because they're kind of, uh... They're, they're put up, but they're not in, like... A booklet. I got hyper distracted. I can't look at Throne right now. But yeah, I added the Kirby little thingies recently. But other than that, I don't know what else I would like ask for, you know? I'm like actually really shy when it comes to asking for stuff. And I, like, I, I super appreciate all the support I've been getting for the channel, but I'm like super shy. <laughs> Um, okay, yeah. Now I gotta move that. And now we could also now tell me I told you so, because, uh... Doo -doo. I'm not using vector lines again, and I should probably be using vector lines. I can't remember if I have my throne set up either. All the way, because I've, I've just been having to do so freaking much. But yeah, I think for Throne, though, I'm gonna try and put stuff that will better the stream. Now that I really think about it. Like, uh, it would be cool if I could do some card openings or whatever. If I get, like, a ton of Pokemon cards. And then I play Tilted Pokemon. <laughs> uh, but what was it? Pokemon Trading Card Online. I play freaking Tilted. And you guys can just watch me be Big Angie. That'd be fun. <laughs> no, it wouldn't. I can't remember the last time I actually played that, but I should probably play it again, because it was a lot of fun. I think. Don't quote me on that. Yeah, no, I'll take the time here to actually put some actual stuff 
on the throne. Because I probably uh, should get that all squared away. We're almost done with Dracomon. Oh my gosh, and it's almost cut off time already? No, we're gonna do it another... <laughs> we're gonna do another extended stream. Because <laughs> I'm finishing this tonight. I'm finishing this charity bit tonight, and nothing can freaking stop me. There we go. I said I was going to finish it tonight, and we're going to finish it tonight. Like, I'm, I'm really trying to think what else I could get to better the stream. You know what I mean? I got the chair to help with my back. I got the saxophone stand, so the saxophone's right next to me during stream. I got the stream deck, because I spoiled myself a little, which is super convenient. If I think of anything else, I'll let you guys know. So maybe we can work towards that. But my main focus is just to better the stream, honestly. <clears throat> oh gosh, but you know what I do need to get? I need to get more freaking. <laughs> I need to get more Mucidex because I'm getting super stuffy again. I gotta remember to get more Mucidex here soon. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done. We just need to do the wing. Hold up. If they're okay, I'm derailing the stream one more time. If they sell musical instruments on Throne, I might request those. <laughs> Probably not, though, right? Oh, snap! They do sell boosters? Oh my gosh, that's a lot of Pokemon cards! Okay, I'm gonna have to put that on the wish list. Oh, and that's like the latest one, isn't it? <laughs> okay, no, no. I just said I was gonna use the throne for the benefit of the stream. I can't just put Pokemon cards on <laughs> the thing. No. Tell me I'm bad, guys. I got excited about Pokemon cards. I can't do that. I cannot. No. And why do I have this cat thing? Oh, you can set up alerts too? Anyway, all right, I'm done derailing the stream. I just got excited for no good reason. <laughs> I do believe we made a joke, though, that I was going to learn the banjo. So I could play banjo and kazooie while playing the banjo. Oh, dude, banjos are like 200 buckaroos on Amazon. I don't know if I want a banjo off of Amazon. Or... 
I don't know where else. Where else would you buy a banjo, guys? Uh, I need to know. Where else could I acquire a banjo? <laughs> I'm just thinking about it, and it's so funny. If I could just freaking buy a banjo, bro. Okay. I want to... Okay, if I was to get... I know I've said this already. In the past. I want... I really want a crumb horn. And it's this really old... Instrument. How is this looking? That's actually not looking that bad. I want a crumb horn. I want a hurdy gurdy. I, I want some weird freaking... <laughs> I want some weird instruments. Though if you played The Witcher, then you probably have heard of the Hurdy Gurdy. Or heard the Hurdy Gurdy in action. Because they do in fact use that, I'm pretty sure. It's... Right? Yes! <laughs> Heck yeah, Kirby Jazz. But yeah, crumb horn for sure. I would love to get a trumpet as well. I think that would be another really boss hoss instrument to get. What else? I don't know if I can play the hurdy gurdy on stream though. It's a pretty big instrument, isn't it? Hold up, I gotta go bug husband. That's going through your TV, honey. Thank you. He's playing a game right now, and the game was going through the TV. And not his headphones. I'm sorry, honey. But yeah, now, if I was to get another instrument in the immediate... This YouTuber I listened to, who does a lot of videos on spooky stuff and internet mysteries, did a deep dive on hurdy-gurdies out of nowhere. Oh, yeah? What'd they talk about? Other than they're, like, super wicked sick. I'm gonna eat this fly. It's back. Like, hurdy-gurdy stuff. <gasps> That's not a fly! Ah! What are you? No! Ah, what are you? Ah! No! No! No, 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 no. Go away. Hi ah! I missed! No. 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 You need to leave! Ah! <laughs> no. No, where'd that go? Where'd that go? There's a bug. Okay, I'm good now. It's gone. The history of instrument, how it's played, stuff like that. Yeah? Heck yeah. Okay, so wait, when were Hurdy Gurdy's invented? Uh, I'm curious. Let, let's quiz Namu now. All right, now I mean, when were hurdy gurdies first invented? Focusing now. Bruh. <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting. I do not <laughs> and I have the mind for trivia right now. Namu Namu. 
I needed to know, though. I needed to know when hurting Gertie's for me, Namu. For no good reason. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just love Crab Rant, dude. And you know I'm totally gonna play Pokemon Unite tonight. After Namu makes me do work. Okay, no. Can I compromise somewhere over there? <laughs> Wikipedia says forever ago. Somewhere over there. Now I'm gonna make a compromise. Let me play at least one game of Pokemon Unite before I get to do more work tonight. At least one. I still need to actually find my harmonica. I misplaced it somewhere. You gotta play Cramorant. Fair enough. It's okay, I can't play anything else other than Cramorant anyway, so I mean... <laughs> I can't play anything else other than Cramorant. Wait, okay, I, I know I'm going back to the throne thing, but can't you guys suggest gifts to me? I think that's a thing. I think I actually feel more comfortable with that. If you guys would like suggests stuff. <gasps> ah, it's back! No, it's back! The bug's back! Go away! Please, go away! Please! No, go away! The bug's back! Oh, yeah! I missed! I missed! I missed! Go away! Psst. Go away, please! No! No, 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 no. Stop it! Stop crawling towards me! It's gone! I am a god! <laughs> I am a fearless god slayer. I'm such a wussy, bro. <laughs> it was a spooky bug, okay? It was coming for me, I know it. At least it wasn't a spider, or the stream would be gone. <laughs> Dude, I'm so good at drawing this <laughs> dopey bird. Alright, and then we can color it real quick. And then we're gonna do the shading bit. So smooth, son. 
<laughs> Bro, I'm such a dork. Go. Should be fine. We're almost there. Okay, I gotta actually sit back in my chair, right? Yeah. yeah. I actually scoot it forward. All right here we go. I'm off for the night. See you later. See ya, Blue. Thanks for stopping by, mate. And you have yourself a good one. Stay hyped. <laughs> and stay hydrated. Good job, me. Okay, yes. Yeah, so we're probably gonna do a bit of an extended stream tonight as well, so I can finish this charity bit. So, like I said, I want to get it done. And not have to, uh... Do it last minute or anything like that, you know what I mean? I still think those duck feet look kind of scuffed, but that's okay. It's gonna have to be okay. So good with Dracomon this time around. Oh, I think I can do that art meme or whatever where they're like, oh, I drew this this year and then now look at it or whatever. Or draw this again, I think it's called. Dude, yeah, I should totally do one of those. Especially for like these two. Camera didn't have an eyeball. Uh oh. It's pretty much done, so yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's done. I haven't saved this whole time either. Merge selected layers. Okay, next I'm gonna decide where the light is coming from just real quick. Probably from. 
direction. I don't know why I put it on that layer, but that's fine. No, no, this is fine. Actually, we'll focus on uh, coloring in Cramorant first. Then we'll get to Dracobon. Thankfully, they're not too... Why? Why? They're not too complicated when it comes to... their colors, so we should be good. No. Please. There we go. Alright. Let's go ahead and color us a cramorant. our base color blue. Psych! Here is our base color blue. Oh yeah, no. Crabbers could be so freaking easy to color. some fancy stuff with the eyeball already. Alright, let's go ahead <clears throat> and color the carrot. So, I would like to do this so then we can, what was it, color? Aha, that's what I was afraid of. So the green is too close to that. Alright, I have a solution. better. I mean, the easier solution would be to change the color of the carrot to be a little lighter. Yeah. And it's alright. Once we actually do stuff to the carrot, it should look a lot better. But... Let's go ahead and put this in a group for Cramorant. Go ahead and move on to Dracomon. 
who is also going to be super easy to color in. Because Dracomon is also only three colors. Thank you, Dracomon. Also, I'm also gonna do a bit, right? Hold on. I'm gonna separate the line art, right? So that Dracomon is on its... No, not the whole freaking thing. Uh -huh. Why? That's not the lasso tool, you actual dingus! <laughs> oh no, I was trying to use, freaking use the lasso tool and that was not working. Alright, there we go. So that's Cramorant. And what's this? What the heck? Get in there. And then here is Dracomon, but I want Dracomon to be behind Cramorant some. So I could do something like this. You know, so that they're at least like kind of interacting with each other, not just like looking. Or not just Dracomon looking at Cramorant, but I kind of want them to be intersecting a little bit. So there we go. pretty happy with the progress that we made tonight. You know what I mean? Like, this is gonna be done. Oh wait, did I forget that Dracomon has an underbelly? I did forget that Dracomon has an underbelly. Hold up. Why? Because it decided to start downloading the movie playing a game. And when it did that, it started crashing the computer and started downloading it with the Oh, so that's why the stream has been dipping a little here and there. I'm sorry. No, you're good, honey. I wondered what was going on. I just started playing the game. I was like, oh, you're playing a game? I just started downloading Awesome. Thanks, Discord. Or not Discord. Uh, Steam. There we go.
And what else is red on Dragon Ball? Nothing else? Okay. Actually, Dracomon's underbelly is not the same color as Cramorant, but I kind of want to see if it could work out. Hmm, not bad. Yeah, not bad at all. That way, they can have a bit of color cohesion, I guess. Uh, I kind of know what I'm doing. <laughs> that didn't look that bad. And then, that means his pearly whites will look even more pearly white. Especially since it's not going to be pure white. Oh heck yeah, I know what I'm talking about, son. And then, well, eye shine can be pure white. And can be on the same layer. Then we're gonna go to the little eyeball and do some, some magic. Heck yeah. Is it underneath of his tail light? No, it's not. Looks for me. Maybe. Mm. That, or do I want to make the claws and stuff all so white? Nah, okay, let's go ahead and change it to his normal color. Yeah, that looks alright. Okay, and let's go ahead and color in our veggies. That, and... Up potatoes. We can go this color for the turnips. Uh, hold on, I got a better color for the turnips. There we go. Mm. It should be fine. we go. Alright, so they're all colored in. And now we can do the shading. I'm the one bit, right? All ready to go. Um, I should have probably put it in shading and highlights because it is technically shading and highlights and not in common effects, but that's okay. This is Dracomon. This is Cramorant. I'm probably gonna have to review the footage of the stream after because I'm kind of worried that stuff is a bit scuffed in terms of setup for streaming. Because I know last time there was a problem when uh, I got the new PC and I was trying to stream Kirby in the Forgotten Land. And it was streaming at low quality for some reason. So I'm gonna double check that 
Afterwards, did I ask Nami to remind me? Yes. I did, in fact, ask Nami to remind me. Thanks, Nami. Alright, let's go ahead and do our shading. Since I separated them, I'm going to put them both in a folder together. So that we can just go ahead and snag that color. Actually, that color is also a really good one. Oh, double psych. Things seem to be streaming at high quality from what I can see. Uh, I might need to still adjust stuff. We will see. Like I said, I'm gonna review the, uh, stream. Wait, that's scuffed. Why is Grammar not in his own freaking... Okay. Hold on. trying to think because I'm gonna color the line art but when I go to color the line art it's gonna get affected by this the easy solution would just be to combine the line art again to combine the line art again and erase. Yeah, I gotta erase Draco laws. <laughs> now we can once again told me tell me I told you so because it would have been real easy to erase if they were just vector lines. Namu <laughs> it's okay, I had fun. And that's what matters most, right? <laughs> Alright, now we can do... The... Shading. Fifty. Oh man, it's already cut off time. Did say that we're gonna keep going though. So it's going to be a bit of an extended stream again tonight, guys. Because I, I, I find that it's really important that I finish this charity bit. Like, I really want to get this done. It's for a good cause, you know?
I'm totally shrimping. Hold on, this shading doesn't make sense. Now it makes sense. Fish. I need to just look at track them on this and I shaded it. Eh. I'm hyper focusing now guys because once we finish the shading we're then done and then I'll be able to post it tomorrow at my usual times I'll be these knees That was weird. The bug is back. Please. No, I'm going to ignore it. I'm going to ignore it, and it's going to leave me alone. Okay? It's going to leave me alone. Please. Please, Mr. Bug. I don't want any trouble.
Dude, whatever that song was is freaking slapping. Sorry, I'm like getting super focused now that we're like at the end point of this picture. Wings would probably actually be shaded. Okay, I think that's looking pretty good. Just need to finish the shading on these leaves. I will actually probably go back real quick on these leaves, yeah? I want to try something. Yeah, the rest of the wings should probably be shaded in. Back here. Okay, last bit. Get a little bit of room lighting, or whatever I do, <laughs> on these horns. There we are! Alright, we'll go to the green parts. bit of gradient to them. Just a smidge of gradient. Yeah, opposite way. Let's make them darker on the ends.
Alright, the shading's a little rough, but it doesn't look that bad. So I'm pretty alright with it right now. Next, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna pull the line art. Just a little bit so I can finish this charity bit off, you know. Because I, I really want to be able to finish it. So now we're gonna color the line art real quick. <laughs> That's looking good. Okay, some on the wing here. Up to Cramorant's beak. Do some on Cramorant's beak. line up on this stuff here. Almost done, actually, which is pretty sick. Go ahead and add some lighting here and there. Up to 50% with a overlay. Yep.
Dude, my last go at these two looks so different now. It's actually pretty wild. Try coloring the line art. One thing I want to try to do is color the eye shine a bit because I don't know. It seems like a cool thing to do. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, last thing. I know, I keep saying last thing. And it's... <laughs> that's perfect. False. The bit I wanted to try. Using comic effects. Which one? We're gonna make it black for now, right? And then we're gonna come back to it here. Then what I want to do is focus on parts that should be a lot darker, right? So like maybe on Cramorant's wing here in the back. And spots like... And uh, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Gotta love some hatching. Heck yeah. Thought I'd give it a go for this picture. Okay, I wanna do a little bit more like on Cramorant's belly here. Then we can go ahead and erase it like so. One last thing. I'm gonna keep saying it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> no, nope, not 100. 50. up some shading here and there. There we are. I don't know if I want to keep it. <gasps> the party's back. Please, please, sir. Uh... <laughs> no, you can't. You can't do that to me. Okay, no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> um, okay, I'm good. Okay, one last thing I want to do. Do I want to keep this? It looks good, though. I actually re- Oh, dude, I actually really like this shading bit. But can we maybe... Hear me out. Change the color of it. Multiply. Oh, I think of that. Get rid of this freaking thing. This looks pretty darn good. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm really happy with how this turned out. Wow. I want to center it more, though. I would like to center it more. Okay, one last thing. One last thing. I'm gonna keep saying it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> the carrots need some texture. 
Or they look kind of goofy. Oh, that looks so much better. Oh my gosh. Tee -hee. <laughs> yeah, those carrots look so much better after I added that texture. Heck yeah. We could also probably do something like this as well. Psych. What? Oh. Wait, what? I'm confused. But okay. There we go. All right, I don't know what else I can do to it, honestly. Like, I'm being serious. I'm not sure how else I can push it. Without, you know, going a bit crazy. And I kind of like how simple it looks right now. Hold on, I linked the thing in the art sharing, right? Yeah, okay. Last, last thing, I promise. I promise. I'm gonna give it a bit. I'm gonna give him a, just a smidge of yellow. Because they are technically in the wheat field holding a bunch of crops, and that's okay. But I wanted them to kind of fit into the picture a little more. And I think this will help. Last, last thing. Tim, sorry! I'm going to fix up the shading here and there. So it's not too terribly rough. I don't mind my shading having a bit of texture, but, uh... <laughs> the wrong bit! There we go. really good all 
All right, there it is. And now, okay, one thing I want to do real quick. I kind of, I kind of want to compare from the last time I drew these two. You know what I mean? Okay, so let me get on my Thavian art. Why do I have 13 notifications? Oof. Oh well. Uh, ba -ba -ba. <gasps> Please! The bug is back! No, sir, you can't, you gotta go. You're not allowed here. <gasps> Please. I'm scared it's gonna like fly in my face. Oh, it's so gross looking. You gotta go. <sighs> Please! Please! I'm gonna flick it! <laughs> Please! You need to leave! 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 I'm Please! Okay, I left. <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm scared of bugs! It's bad! <laughs> Stop! I don't know where it went now. It's terrorizing me. We gotta do this real quick. We gotta, we gotta do this real quick. Okay, technically, <laughs> copy image. I'll, I'll like do the compare. You, I swear. I swear, please. You gotta go, buddy. You're not. Please, please. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I'm good now. No worries. Okay, so I technically. Drew, these, these are like the two most recent times I've drawn them. Maybe the only times I've drawn them? I don't know. Get down here. <sighs> there we are. But yeah. Well, this one is a cookie, so I guess this one doesn't really count. But So I guess we should really be focusing on this one. Is when I legit drew them, drew them. What a difference. Okay, so this one is in 2020. Yeah, 2020. What month? They don't give you a month anymore? Bro. Oh, yeah, they do. I'm blind. May of 2020. Really? May? Bro. What bug is it? I don't know. It's a creepy crawly one. What are you going to do with the background? Nothing. Because in order for me to submit... Give him a gum. If he'd leave me alone, I'd give him a gum. So, I'm not actually supposed to put a background... I guess if I go to submit it online, and then I send one without, that should be fine. Uh, I'm probably just gonna do it simple. <gasps> Please. Background. The bug is back. I don't know what kind of bug it is. Uh, it's a bug that needs to leave me alone. But yeah. It's so crazy to see how drastic of a change my art has gone through in two years. You know what I mean? Like, these two look so, like, different. I honestly like how I, this one turned out a little bit more. Ah, uh, it's so cool! I love it! I love how much my art has changed. Take a picture of the bug. Well, if the bug comes back, yeah, I'll try. But the little jerk keeps jumping around. He's like a tiny little, like, green bug. I won't say tiny. He's pretty big enough to where it bothers me. But yeah, I can't believe how different it is now. I'm just I'm sorry. I'm just like looking at my art from then and now. I should prob- oh, I should- I should do a before and after thing. <gasps> Stop it. It keeps flying in and out. Yeah, I think I've improved a lot in two years. I don't know. What do you guys think? 
I'll like also post a ah! Wait, do you say it was green? Yes, the bug is green and I think it flew under my tablet. No Wait, where'd it go? Where'd it go? I, it flew under my tablet and now it's gone. <laughs> it's there. It's here. Oh, it's on the tablet. No, no. I can't reach for the phone, guys. It's in the way. Ah, please, please, please. Oh. No. I'm scared. <laughs> looks like a bug that usually hangs out in the grass, you know? I don't know. It's a grass bug. I don't know. Ah! No! Don't move! Don't move! Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> okay! I, I, guys, I have to go. I, this bug is trying to square up on me. I'll try to take a picture of it before I freaking kill it. <laughs> it's a grasshopper. It's gotta be a grasshopper. It's like a tiny little... What's the shape? I'm gonna draw the bug real quick. <laughs> oh dear, really? This stream really hard and I'm trying to leave. It looks like... <laughs> I'm scared! I'm scared! I'm scared. It looks like this shape from the top and it kind of looks like a weird looking banana. From the side, okay? And then the color, right? Where did it freaking go? Looks kind of like this. And it can fly, apparently. <laughs> Looks like this. Stop it! It came back! What do you got there? Is it a metapod? <laughs> I wish it was a metapod. I don't know where it went now. Guys, it keeps... It keeps going around. It won't sit still. I found it. I'm gonna draw the bug now. <laughs> it tried to fly in my face! I am allowed to be upset about that! It tried to fly in my face! That's what the bug looks like, okay? Okay, that's what the bug looks like, alright? I don't know what kind of bug it is, but it needs to freaking leave my house. I'm getting sweaty. It's kind of like a stink bug. Ooh, yeah. But if it is, kill it immediately. I don't want to kill it if it's a stink bug. That sounds like the worst idea possible. Do you say don't kill it? Hold on. 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 Sit still. It's too small! Stop it! <laughs> it's too small. Okay, I'll look up a picture of it, okay? It shouldn't be that hard. Die! I flicked it. Okay, yeah, back to... Back to me, uh, uh, squeeing about my art, okay? Stupid bug. Actually, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. <laughs> I'm just gonna go. You? Alright. Uh, I need to leave, guys. I need to eat some din. Because me hungry. And I gotta put some freaking lip, lip balm on. Oh. But anyway, uh, tomorrow I'm not sure what we're gonna play. Like I said, I kind of wanted this week to be chill because everything is still pretty scuffed. So it's either don't don't you freaking fly at me, you little monster. It's either gonna be more banjo kazooie or uh, more of me screaming at a Kirby game. 
It's one of the two. And then Saturday is obviously... It's also known as a bug that will suck blood out of your lips while you're sleeping. Okay, this bug needs to die. <laughs> this bug needs to freaking die. You can't do that to me. It looks like a bug that would hang out in the grass, okay? Like, and then you're like mowing the grass and then this bug just kind of comes out. It's like a grass bug. It's not a grasshopper. I'm blinding myself right now because I'm looking directly in my lamp. So yeah, tomorrow's probably more a uh, video game. Right? Is that on the... Namu, is that on the schedule? Because <laughs> I can't remember. Thursday is a game. Friday is art. Saturday is monster hunter, open hub hunting, grasshoppers jump, not fly. Uh, no. Grasshoppers... Well, yes. Yes, but, sir. I don't know, mate. Me either. They undergo a radical change later in the life cycle. I'm asleep. Grasshoppers actually won't be what the heck? Well, the more you know. Uh, I'll reveal what the bug- I'll do a bug reveal here in a sec as well. Look forward to that because this bug is wigging me out. So yeah, um, I'm gonna head out. I'll post, uh, a screenshot of the picture for everybody to take a gander at. I'm gonna go eat. And fight this bug. Do not! It's squaring up. I gotta go. Bye bye, guys. Ah. Uh, remember me. <laughs> uh, it's coming closer. Remember me!